First up, a future member of the Round Table of Black Air Force activity, Aizen. This oh, man yeah, did yeah. some of the most disrespectful yeah. shit I've ever seen in an anime. This man stopped Ichigo's Bankai with a finger. A fucking finger, nigga! He didn't even take the time out of his day to block it with his sword. Man Yo. said, fuck it. I only need a finger for your sorry ass. Oh, at bro. my gosh. Says, oh, my. <laughs> Yo, this guy really just said, I tried to cut him in half at the waist. I guess my finger was too shallow. <laughs> but nah, nah, nah. You know what was the most disrespectful? I haven't even seen moment? that part. Just piece your eyes on this real quick. Okay, talk to me. This man stopped his theme song. He stopped the protagonist. I didn't even catch that. Theme song. I did not Nigga. even catch oh that. Oh my god. That's gotta be one of the most disrespectful things you could ever do to a protagonist. <laughs> Stop their theme song with a finger. Wait, so when he moved his finger like that, he cut him? What the fuck? Yo, I gotta check out Bleach. I have to check out Bleach. What the hell is going on? Like, because for real, like, they was gassing this man Ichigo up. I mean, he just beat Byakuya. They just rescued Rukia, so everything is going great, right? So you thinking nobody can stop my boy right now. He about to smack the shit out of this, oh, I take AP classes looking ass boy. <laughs> this man Eisen really said cut the music little nigga. Hey yo, then after that, this man probably had the best exit of all time. This man just looks down at their asses like you inferior ass beats. Y'all niggas ain't shit. This man takes off the glasses, slicks back his hair with no gel, my nigga. No he gel. Turns into a whole ass Chad. And I bet you money he planned that shit too. And look at him just looking down on Ichigo like farewell, little nigga. By the way, everything that happens in this show, I planned that shit. Absolutely disrespectful, hey, bro. Come on, let me do something real quick. And Talk to just squeeze him right here. Act like nobody noticed. And uh, perfect. All right, uh, moving on. Meliot is beating the shit out of this big ass purple glue stick. Like this. Yo, one, that purple nigga <laughs> pissed me off. Bruh. I can't even describe how much of a disrespectful ass whooping this shit was. This it was man very was disrespectful. Beating his ass with the most sadistic smirk on his face. This man activated that Black Air Force energy, and it was a wrap. When I seen this, I was so scared, bro. I didn't know what was going on. Seeing Meliodas like this had me frightened, bro. Meliodas is one of my favorite characters. And I like the the sunshine and joyfulness of him. When he turned like this, I was like, yo, no, stop, please, never again. Most sadistic Look at his on face. His. This man activated that Black Air Force energy and it was a wrap. Just absolutely tearing through this mutated form of Barney. Oh, bro, and this is where the disrespect began. He walked up to him there with a straight ass face, patted him on the cheek, then slapped a shit out of his ass. God damn! Slapped his ass like a pimp slapping an ungrateful hoe. Like, yo, he did this shit with no effort. The he really did not. Across the ground. I mean, this is how this shit basically went down, but roll the clip. Water down face, Barney. You should take pride again, your ass beat by me, little Hey, yo! <laughs> um, hello, Earth to dumbass. You're the one shrinking right now. <laughs> no, no! Ah, you're in denial. Well, let me slap the shit out of you real quick. <laughs> Damn, what the fuck? I told your stupid ass, but you didn't want to listen. Now look who's the little nigga. So after Fraudron has a sympathy segment, this man's like, all right, fine, I quit. Just kill me already. And then this man was like, say less. Fuck your backstory, nigga. The man didn't give a fuck. He just killed him. An uppercut from hell with a smile on his face. This man did not fall for that backstory, no juicing. The man said, fuck your sympathy, boy. Get that shit out of here, nigga. Then everybody's like, damn. He didn't fall for that backstory, no bullshit. Absolutely violated Barney in his final form. All right, next up, High School of the Dead. Oh. I've actually watched this. I've actually watched this. Man, if you've seen this anime, you know exactly what's coming. So zombies are attacking the school and shit. So my guy's like, ah, oh, shit, I got to get my homies out of here. So right. this dude busts up in the classroom, grabs Ray, and the boyfriend's like, hey, bro, what the hell are you doing? And he tells him that people just got killed at the gate, but of course she didn't believe him. So how did he make her believe it? Ah, oh, fuck it. So drop the shit out of that bitch. He did this in front of the class and in front, in front of the boyfriend, bro. If I seen that shit, I will have to kill this nigga. What the fuck are you doing? Don't ever disrespect me in front of the school. <laughs> and if you're going to snap my girl, first of all, I say in front of the school, like, bro, you snap my girl. 
I don't know. My girl in high school, you, you can smack the shit out of her. I don't know now that we're thinking about it. Hmm. If it was my girl in high school, you smack the shit out of her. But if you like my girl now, whoever my next girl is, I gotta kill the person. I gotta kill him. What the fuck are you doing, bro? Don't ever disrespect me and my girl and my situation and my life. And my <laughs> don't ever disrespect me, bro. Because <laughs> what the fuck is you doing, bro? Don't do that shit. Look at his face, bro. Look at like, he slapped my bitch in front of me. Like, no, bro, stop. <laughs> Fuck it. Dude, the shit out of that bitch. He did this in front of the class and in front of her boyfriend, bro. Oh, no. He a pump, bro. This man slapped the Dude, piss Damn. Out. Man took a whole tactic out of niggalations. Like, this man been listening to way too much future. Nigga was like, Hendrix. <laughs> and the boyfriend looking like, damn. He really just slapped my girl like that. Yeah. Like, yo, nigga, you just yeah. got cucked in front of the whole class. You like, did. Straight up into yard, bro. And bro, he's, he's a uh, he's a beta for real. Shit out of me. Wait, she bro, got wet from it. She got wet. Happened again, real quick. <sighs> she got wet from it. <sighs> shit. Huh? <sighs> you had a voiceover. Bitch, get the fuck up. Time to go. Damn, nigga. Hey, cool. What the fuck you doing to my girl, bro? The fuck am I doing? Nigga, the ops is outside right now. Wait, what you mean, cook? I just saw two niggas get iced out there, jit. The fuck, nigga? Hey, yo. Oh, my gosh, what the fuck is happening right now? Yo, when black people voice over animes, it's so fucking hilarious, bro. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck, bro? Give this man his flowers while he's here. He's hilarious. I just saw two niggas get iced out there, jit. The fuck, nigga, I ain't careful. Oh, my gosh. What the fuck is happening right now? I'm not trying to have some of your bullshit. Shut the fuck up. Damn, you just really smacked the shit out of that bitch. Oh, fuck that shit! Bitch, I told you to shut the fuck up. Oh, yeah. Damn. Damn. Hey, I always wanted to fuck the shit out of her. I ain't gonna lie to you, bro. I don't know. Something about her, when she put them glasses on, I was like... Woo! Oh, my God. Bitch, I told you to shut the fuck up. Damn, that nigga sexy for that. Oh, I just got cooked. Damn, bro, niggas slapped the antennas off this bitch. Mm. And finally, for our last one, is one of the most disrespectful moments in anime history. This nigga, Kurapika, brought a shovel uh. to a fight. What? A fucking shovel. <laughs> what the f- No, no. Who the fuck thinks of this shit? He, he brought knew. a shovel so he could bury the nigga. Oh my god, he this knew. man was on pure demon time. Yeah, he so knew. So he starts fighting this big ass Wolverine Kaioken caveman looking ass nigga and beats the living brakes off him. Like, it got to the point like this shit was just pure torture. The fucker was determined to avenge his clan. And then Uvo was just at the point where like, he, he just had to off himself. Any last words before you die? Yeah. You look like a girl. Ha! <laughs> he does. That's that's just smash though. Fuck you. Game over. But no 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 like on some on some real shit on some real shit y'all on some real shit. Tell me y'all would not smash Crappyka like on some real shit would y'all not smash Crappyka? Hey hey sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do. If it was only you and Crappyka on Earth and all the last two people would you not smash shit? I would. I ain't. I ain't. <laughs> I ain't gonna let y'all down. I'm gonna smash. Somehow, some way, we're gonna repopulate the earth. Time for the most disrespectful moments in anime history. Too. I've been waiting now for this, bro. Hurry this up. This one is gonna be a little different. So usually, we would have multiple characters from multiple animes in the video. But today, we're gonna be focusing on one character. One boy? Now, I know some of y'all are probably wondering, CJ, why are you only focusing on one character in this vid? Well, uh... How do I put this? The man that we are about to talk about might damn well be the most disrespectful man in anime history. Yo, why is his body like <laughs> that? Ladies and gentlemen, Yujiro Hanma is a walking black air force. Hold like, on, dog, this... this nigga's on demon timing 24 7. This From Baki slapping bitches to beating the fuck out of his own son. Nigga out here fighting a polar bear for fun. Like, this man's nickname is Ew, the what strongest the fuck is that? creature on. <laughs> This Baki or Akira? I think this is Baki. Baki is bro. When I, I watched Baki with Kai at Dante House, and I regret it. I truthfully regret it. I do not like this show at all. I know a lot of people say it's like one of the best. Like this man's nickname is the strongest creature on Earth. Peep how they said creature instead of human. <laughs> I mean, bro, 
man, Cap, look the at strongest. this nigga. This man got zero points. I've seen this. I've seen this part. Fat. A jawline gifted from Jesus himself. His back is a literal second torso. Bro, oh, back up, bro, back up. You got a six pack on your back, nigga. <laughs> back yeah, up, bro. I understand why they call him Creature now. Like, if you get compared to Bigfoot's fat ass, you, you, you's literally just, I don't know, nigga. You just built different. Oh, yeah. Free nah, ass for shit. Real. Oh, but I can hear some of y'all already typing in the comment section right now. Hey, hey, yo, CJ. Why that nigga not at the round table yet, cuz? Listen, 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 listen. I know Yujiro has been the most requested person to be in the round table of Black Air Force activity, besides like guts. Well, you wanna know why it took me so long to do this? Because you see, this man has done so much heinous ass shit that I cannot give him a regular trial. Like dead ass, I would run out of exhibits. So I was like, ah, right, wow. Bro. I'm just gonna have to give him a whole most disrespectful moments in anime history episode to himself. Cause this. Is he really like that? I have not seen this show at all, but is he really like that? Is he really like that? I haven't even seen Berserk yet. If that's what it, where um, Gus is from, I haven't even seen that yet. But what y'all talking about this guy, like he's a menace menace, not just all, he's a menace. No, like he's a menace menace. Like he's disrespectful, disrespectful. I'm just gonna have to give him a whole most disrespectful moments in anime history episode to himself. Cause this is the only way I could do it because it's gonna be a lot, bro. Like I'm probably not even gonna be able to add everything. Yo, on why he looking so like that, bro? Anything I leave off, just tell me and I'm gonna just put him in other parts. So everybody sit back, relax, grab some popcorn, lace up your black ones and uh, huh? let's get started. So to understand the philosophy of Yujiro Hanma's disrespectful ways, we have to go all the way back. So far back, the main character ain't even born yet. I'm talking about 1973 in the, the Vietnam War. He's not the main character. He's fighting in a whole ass war with his bare hands at the age of 16. Nigga, this is like the equivalent of running around in war zone with your bare fist and just beating the shit out of everybody. How like, are you not? fucking took guerrilla warfare to a whole nother level on some pure ass Rambo type shit. So and bent the Vietnam, gun? What the fuck? named Jane and she out here trying to throw that ass back she tried to seduce the hell out of this man she like you want to get laid nigga oh you scared or maybe you still haven't experienced a woman yet and look at this man he like uh bitch shut the fuck up <laughs> he just turns around and walks away <laughs> bruh man it's like i'm not about this bullshit today but she still keep on running her mouth and talking shit so the moment she turned around this man yujiro came right behind her back and said shall i tear your skull out right here homie was dead ass about to peel the skin off of this bitch and look at her she like damn this nigga got two fingers in my mouth then this man just pimp slaps her like 20 yards gave her a whole lecture then walked out into the sunset but nah you thought this man was done oh, in vietnam man. no he was just getting started this man goes on to kill a whole ass general on some covert ops type shit and to disguise himself so he could enter the base he ripped off the general's face and used it as a mask so then this man just runs wild just beating the shit out of him killing every single person in his path busting through ceilings and shit so then jane pops back up and she's like listen nigga i got some tnt and i'm about to blow this bitch what the fuck so while they're escaping you jiro stops she's like what the fuck nigga why you stop and he just stands there and just eats the entire explosion then he pimp slaps old girl again and he figures out that she's a whole ass un agent named diane that's leading him into a whole trap so she tried to kill him but obviously uh that ain't gonna work honey so how did he make her pay for this uh, well he gave her that redo of the healer treatment wait wait what happened so after he gives her the googlies this man uses her as a wait 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 what is the redo of the healer treatment? What is that? What is the redo of the healer treatment? I want to know and I want to understand what the fuck is the redo of healer treatment? It is better than not know. The redo of the healer did he like force himself upon her? Is that what y'all sound what y'all trying to say? Is that what y'all trying to say? He R worded her. Oh. 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 Honey. So how did he make her pay for this? Uh, well, he gave her that redo of the healer treatment. So after he gives her the googlies, this man uses she her as a out. body His dick was so and crazy that she passed outside out. and breaks this nigga's neck with one hand. So all girl holds this man up at gunpoint, trying to kill him again. Then this man flashed the whole demon back at her and just look at her face, bruh. Just in pure shock. She like, damn. I'm really about to have that nigga's kid. And ladies and gentlemen, that is how yeah. Jack Hama was born. Oh, but guess what? That was just the first son. Shit, we got 
This nigga had sex one time and is unlucky. He was unlucky. He had sex one time, non-consensual sex one time, and had a baby. How the fuck? <laughs> how did... Oh, but guess what? That was just the first son. Shit, we gotta go over how the main character Wait, was that born. was the <clears throat> first son? Meet Emmy. Baki's crazy ass, weird ass mom. Like, for all, I ain't gonna count this bitch is weird as hell. But, ladies and gentlemen, she always wasn't a crazy ass bitch. No, no, you see, back in the day, she was in a very happy relationship with a rich nigga. She was enjoying her life on a honeymoon. So then that night, they go to a party, right? And guess who's there? Yujiro, staring her ass down while she with her mans at a party and look at her bro she is mesmerized it's bro like a nigga was staring her at down me. with just his eyes so then the I husband just it. sees her just straight up staring at him and then he just slaps her ass god damn in front is she of the scared party, of the hero so or then this man she just and he's talking mad shit niggas like your fashion sense ass your cut ass your shoes ass, ass. your demeanor ass, ass. he just throws a whole plate of soup on my nigga so yujiro's like oh you want to get disrespectful all right i could get real disrespectful real quick so he just leans in and kisses his wife so homie gets mad and he's like, alright bro, I'ma let this dude handle you. But we all know th this nigga ain't gonna do shit. So you general just gives him the nastiest axe kick and just drills his face into the ground. Just completely one shot. Yo, what Embarrassing the fuck? old dude even more and giving his wife the old giddy giddies. So then this man goes back to his hotel all he's mad and shit because he got made to look like a whole ass beta male in front of his wife. So then he trying to take out his anger on his wife and shit. But this man Yujiro pulls up in the hotel room just out of nowhere. Man is like, hey girl, I came to see you in homeboy's room. So then dude runs over to the phone all scared and shit like, hey yo security, where the fuck y'all niggas at? Somebody come help. Yo. And well, uh, security. He killed the security. Oh, you knock him out. Oh, oh. Them niggas knocked the f out. So old dude pulls a gun on him, but we all know what happens when you try to pull a gun on this nigga. He grabs him with one hand and breaks his neck while still flirting at the same time. And look at her, she liked that. Oh, she a freak. So then he like, listen, girl, let me give you the sweet talk real quick. I want to break your back so goddamn hard right now. Shit, I might even break your back so goddamn hard. I might even kill you one day. Give birth to my child so I can have a worthy opponent in the future. And yeah, uh, wait, that's how Baki was born. So wait, 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 wait. He wants to fight his own child because only his child is strong enough to fight him. Am I getting that? That, that actually, I'm not even mad at it. I'm not mad at it. It makes sense. It makes sense. If you were born a god, you can only breed other gods. And other gods cannot be born unless you, the god, makes another kid. I understand that, you know what I'm saying? I was born, I wasn't born into the guy business. I made my way, you know what I'm saying? So, I understand. So when Yujiro first makes his first appearance in the anime, this man is jumping out of a whole ass helicopter and just blasts himself into a room, not giving a fuck about property damage at all. So he comes in when Baki was fighting Hanayama. And look at him, bro, with a whole smile on his face. He's like, what's good, nigga? Homie deadass said, good, I made it in time. Looks like you just got started. Y'all niggas only got scratches right now. And the fight is already over. But this man Yujiro's like, nigga, if I don't see blood, the shit didn't even start. Then he just straight up tells Baki, nigga, you soft. And he's just laughing his ass off. So then Hanayama's like, all right, bro, I'll fight you. But my, my nigga, you shouldn't have said that shit. What the that ass fuck? <laughs> if the dad said you're soft, <laughs> if the dad says you're soft, what makes you think that he is not the hardest nigga out here? And I say pause with all degrees, pause. That's some gay ass shit I just said. But if the dad just called his son soft after y'all just fought, y'all look like y'all were fighting to the death, but didn't die. You know, y'all fighting, y'all really throwing them shits. And you say, hey, I want to fight you. What the fuck is wrong with you? Are you okay? <laughs> <laughs> fight you but my, my nigga you shouldn't have said that shit because boy that ass was getting <laughs> man literally picked up this big ass nigga with one hand and threw him across the floor and just <laughs> knocks him into the wall so all right bro all right bro that's enough that's enough so he comes running in just to get that signature back in literally spams his whole body out so before he leaves he picks up hanayama again and he's like let me get in one last lick then he punches his whole face and finishes what the job fuck that he why finished. and he's like this was a waste of time y'all niggas it really sorry. was <laughs> oh my god, yo, this man is actually built different. So then he goes see Emmy's crazy ass. <laughs> she just starts trying to beat him, but he ain't even moving, bro. <laughs> then he just pushes her down and he's like, bitch, I told you to raise my son to be strong as hell. That nigga weak as fuck. So then she tried to shake him, but he was like, cut that shit out. <laughs> yo, this man is like completely ruined her mind. Like he must have 
blasted her brains out of something. So after all that goes down, Baki's like, all right, bro, I gotta fight my dad at this point. So the night before the fight, Emmy's like, shit, let me go see what that nigga Yujiro doing real quick. So she's watching this man train in the hotel room, right? So she's like, mm, let me touch up on that nigga. Then he just grabs her whole face and just pushes her back. Look at this nigga. He's like, bitch, the fuck? Don't approach me until I tell you to approach me. You better hope to God Baki can fight me no more or else your ass is grass to me. So she's like, I'll stay tonight. And he said, nah, bitch, get the fuck out. Bro, look at her. This nigga Yujiro has absolutely broken her mind at this point. This she just starts beating up on Baki like, why won't he love me? Oh my god. I told y'all this bitch was weird. She out here beating up her own son because her husband won't love her. <laughs> Shit. My boy Baki. Damn, got bro. Baki just looks. He looks sad. That's fucked up. That's a fucked up storyline, bro. Look at him. Look at him. Look at his face, y'all. This man is sad. Where is my game at, bro? Look at his face, y'all. He just looks sad. He looks like a disappointment. <laughs> that shit is horrible. It's not funny. It's not funny, y'all. Most fucked up family I've ever seen. Shit, I don't know who's more dysfunctional at this point. The Hanmas, the Mishimas, or the Skywalkers. So then the Baki and Yujiro. The, bro, the, mis the, mi the bro, bro, Tekken, the Mishimas, bro. They just throw their kids off the cliff. They threw it. <laughs> They throw their kids off a cliff in every game. Somebody is getting thrown off a cliff, bro. That's enough for me to just be like, I don't want to be part of this family no more, honestly. More dysfunctional at this point. The Hanmas, the Mishimas, or the Skywalkers. So then Baki and Yujiro finally fight, but dear God, bro, this was the worst ass whooping I've probably ever seen. This man was literally eating every single punch he threw at him, not even moving a muscle. And while he's just standing there, he's literally complimenting everybody for thank you for raising him like this, guys. Y'all actually made him kind of strong. So then this nigga's like, all right, bro, it's time to eat. So he just starts wailing on him. He knocked him out. To his son? His That's his son? The ground over and over and over constantly. I can't post it on TikTok now. And everybody's just watching this like, God damn. Is, is that the guy from earlier? So then the mom's like, all right, I've been being weird as f the whole time. This nigga's beating the f out of my son. So then she started trying to swing on Yujiro, but dear God, baby girl. So she started biting him and shit. So then Yujiro gives her a whole bear hug and he's like, Remember if he cracks her back one day, I might break your back so goddamn hard it might even kill you. Today's the day, bitch. Okay. This man literally killed his wife and beat the hell out of his son in one night. And after that, he's like, y'all niggas want to have fun too? He just starts beating the hell out of him while he's watching it. Right? <laughs> yo, yo, he won. He won, bro. He won. Imagine going there to support your boy and you get fucked up too just by watching. I could not be your friend no more, bro. I cannot be your friend. If I'm watching you and supporting you, fight your dad. First of all, why am I even there? But if I'm in that situation, fuck it. We roll. And I get beat up too for watching <laughs> and supporting. I gotta go, bro. I got like, first of all, Yujiro is gonna fuck you up to the point that you're not gonna wanna exist no more. So, I don't know what I would do. I'd be like, bro, I don't want no smoke with you. Then you go by, you're a weakling and they just crack my back or some shit. Like, what the fuck, nigga? No, no, bro, no. Snap my neck. And, nah, bro, I'm good. I'm good. And after that, he's like, y'all niggas wanna have fun too? He just starts beating the hell out of him. I was watching it. But after he killed his wife in dead ass just beat the fuck out of his son. Yujiro just goes around just doing his daily life, doing his daily activities, just disrespecting people. Homie went up into a boxing gym, started throwing shit around, literally slapping this man's punches away. Throws his ass down and just beats everybody up at the gym. Busted up into the prime minister's office, literally beat the brakes off of his entire security force. And while he was doing this, he took a break and smoked a cigarette. Like, that look is at them, bro. They surrounded him with hell. riot shields and everything and couldn't do Freak shit. Nigga just hit the dash. Breaks ah. both of their arms. Busts into his office and he's like, hey, nigga, your security is ass. And also, fuck your dad. And then we go into the next arc and my guy Baki's like, bro, I gotta get revenge for this dude killing my mom. So when Yujiro's confront Jack, he's like, hey, nigga, you kind of strong. Now fight me, nigga. But then Baki comes in and he intervenes. So then Yujiro's like, nigga, if you don't get the fuck up on out of here, boy, I ain't got time for How did you not see that coming? And also on the same arc, he fights Dopo, reveals his 1% body fat demon back, beats the living piss out of him, also taking the nigga's eye and knocked him out standing up. So after all that goes down, what happened? What happened? Fight Muhammad Ali. What the him. fuck just happened? The fuck just happened to the audio? You heard that shit? Taking the nigga's eye and knocked yeah. him out standing up. So after all that goes down. What the fuck? 
him fight Muhammad Ali. It shows him flicking his son across the planet. <laughs> He sent that little nigga. Put my audio up. This man, you don't want me to hear the truth. House and he's like, hey, nigga, I see you about to do hey, it with yo, your girl and shit. Fuck? Okay. Now, when you first see this and you're like, oh my God, this is the ultimate cock block. This man is literally standing over them while him and his girl are about to get it on. And he is dead ass encouraging them to do this shit. He's like, yep. Yeah. <laughs> yo. Yo. Bro, I'm sorry, bro. I'm so I'm all. <laughs> Imagine if you're bro, just imagine the consequences of this. Just imagine the consequences. Let's say Baki doesn't hit it right or Baki comes fast. He's getting punched in the fucking face and his dad probably is gonna do whatever he wants with the girl. Look just imagine how bad this can be. This is horrible. This is literally horrible. You can't win, bro. Your dad is standing over you. He's a menace. His dad is a menace at this point. Like, let's be real. His dad is a tragedy. Like, what the fuck happened? But he is standing over you while you're about to have sex and told you to do it. And if you don't do it, you're a weakling. And if you don't do it, you're getting punched in the face. And if you do it wrong, you're getting punched in the face. I think he's going to get punched in the face no matter what. I'm being honest. I'm being honest. He's going to get punched in the face, bro. You can't win. You can't win, bro. Just imagine if your parents pulled up to you and told you, do it. <laughs> while they're standing there, bro. I get pee pee shot. I can't perform now. I'm not a performer, bro. <laughs> I just try to get my nut and go. I'm not a performer. I can't do the OnlyFans. I can't do the 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 uh the porn. I can't do none of that, bro. I can't. I'm a I'm a lover, bro. I can't perform and have people watch me. That's crazy, man. But if y'all can't, I'll shout out to y'all. But look, I couldn't do it, dog. That's not. That's, I gotta be like on some crazy drugs, bro. You know, get get out of my system. You know what I'm saying? I gotta do it one time. I haven't done it before. I haven't done nothing. I'm actually a virgin the whole time. This man is literally standing over them while him and his girl are about to get it on. And he is dead ass encouraging them to do this shit. He's like, yes, Baki, blow her back out. Blow her back out like I did your mother. It'll make you stronger than ever. And I'm just watching that shit like, did this nigga just really encourage his son to beat the fuck out of her cheeks? Because it'll make him stronger? What in the hell? What and then Baki's like, sex he be bro, having? why are you in here, nigga? And yo, this man dead ass says this. You're pretty funny, you know that kid? A girl sneaks into your room, comes on to you, and you tremble with fear. If that's your idea of closing the deal, I'll never be a granddad. <laughs> Yo, this man just took a shot at every single harem protagonist. So then this man's like, I give you my blessing, then just leaves. So then we cut to this fight with Multibay. Did he smash? Now, Multibay has won the fight. He cut off old poison dude's hand and's like, hey, nigga, that's a wrap. Concede. Nigga, you lost. So then just out of the blue, this nigga Yujiro just comes out of nowhere. He's like, hey, nigga, what's cracking? So this man Yo, pulls his, his sword off like that all the time. But then this man Yujiro does the most demoralizing thing. Right, I gotta I've see this, man. I gotta see this. He Come started on. laughing, grabbed oh, wow. his sword, and started breaking it into pieces one by one slowly. Look Put at this the sword face. down. This I'll just, just drop the sword and run away. Nigga, I'm fucked. That, that just drains all of your confidence. That is like the biggest you ain't shit thing that you could ever do to somebody. So then this man Yujiro pulls up on Yanagi and he's like, hey, nigga. You lost. So then Shibukawa pulls up and he's like, hey, bro, what the fuck are y'all doing out here? It's late as hell. Then Yujiro's like, shit, nigga, you right. I'm tired. I'm going home. But not at the mm -hmm. the got your stupid ass. <laughs> Yo, he just blasted his face. Homie knocked the fuck out and just tooted up. Nigga, dead ass said, you didn't lose. So that meant you were up for my challenge. Man, literally had to get in one lick before he left. So then we get to the right tie tournament. Why? Lord why is he mercy. like this? Why? Why? One lick why, why, why? Why is he like this? Why? 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 So then this man, Yujiro, pulls up on Yanagi and he's like, hey, nigga, you lost. So then Shibukawa pulls up and he's like, hey, bro, what the fuck are y'all doing out here? It's late as hell. Then Who Yujiro's is Shibukawa? Like, Shit, nigga, you right. I'm tired. I'm going home. But not after that. Mm -hmm. Got your stupid ass. Yo, he just blasted his face. Homie knocked the fuck out and just tooted up. <laughs> nigga, dead ass said you didn't lose. So that meant you were up for my challenge. Man, literally had to get in one lick before he left. So then we get to the he right time. He, he knows he the Lord strongest, bro. Ooh, I'm gonna have he to didn't even need to do that. So hard. This man ripped off this nigga's face. He literally dug his fingers into his f***ing face and flung that shit and just straight up busted his face. Then he threw his face into the crowd. Oh my god, that's fucking disgusting. But after that, homie comes for round two, but Your nigga, face is gone. Round two against this nigga. And then you just the blasts his dick into his face. Finally, to I guess finish the job. I mean, the job was already finished, but shit. He had to finish it again. So then he sees Baki oh backstage. He's like, Dad, I think I can take you now. <laughs> this man, Yujiro, was looking at him like, 
Really, nigga? Just throws him through the wall. Man was like, you ain't shit and you still ain't shit. So then he fights the old OG for the last fight. And I ain't gonna lie, old OG was landing some punches. Mm -hmm. But this nigga Yujiro did not care that he was beating the fuck out of a senior citizen. Cause goddamn, he was whooping that ass. I mean, even though that the senior citizen- Wait, he wheelchaired him out? He wheelchaired him out and beat his ass? <laughs> Yo, I'm about to cry. Yo, he wheelchaired him out, bro. And then beat his ass. Oh my gosh. I'm about to cry. That's hilarious. That's hilarious. I'm sorry. Fight. And I ain't gonna lie, old OG was landing some punches. Mm -hmm. But this nigga Yujiro did not care that he was beating the fuck out of a senior citizen. Cause goddamn, he was whooping that ass. I mean, even though that the senior citizen dropped him. Homie pulled out that demon back and there he got it was a wrap. Made the motherfucker kick the bucket in the middle of the fight. Somehow that man came back to life. I don't know if they got the dragon oh, ball or some died. shit, but... That's one lucky ass OG, I'll tell you that. It's oh. a win for martial uh, arts. Anybody that says that has lost. Just goes ahead and uh, just proves it that uh, my man Yujiro has finally entered the round table of Black Air Force activity. He deserves I, it. I think it might be safe to say that this man might be the most disrespectful man in anime history. I mean, he don't care if you man or woman, child or senior citizen. He's he smacked a the child? Shit I didn't realize that. His hands are I mean, dead ass ready child, to for everyone. So yes, he is finally in the round table of Black Air Force activity. I see we got a bigger uh, table, man. We got a bigger table like that. Like that. forever to make. So yeah, uh, that's the most disrespectful moments in anime history to the Yujiro Hanma special. This man is a certified walking black air force. Nah, uh, he is. He is. And, uh, I'm scared I'm of him. If I see him, if I see anybody dressed up as him for Halloween, I'm running away, bro. First up to the plate is actually a moment that came out pretty recently. And what happened? What happened, bro? Nezuko stomping out Daki. Now, I can hear him about see, this. Chandro's fighting Daki right now, and he's about to cut the chat off. But bro <laughs> ended up choking because the nigga forgot to breathe. So while he's doing this, this nigga forgot to breathe. breathe. That's like trying to get his breath back. Rule number one: when you come out the coach. Oh. Yo, she's like, don't touch yeah. my brother. Made the whole world like a bowling ball. Man, look at her. She angry as hell. Demon right time, right Nezuko. Bamboo retainer, whatever the hell that is. All that damn slobber coming out of damn mouth. Like, she be thirsty, bro. Half of her head off. So they start boxing, but Daki gives her the chop and just slings her like three houses Oh my down. goodness, is she okay? Please get up. And she is still angry as sh so Why is she Daki not mad, bro? She's always mad. Shit. Nezuko gets up from that and regrows literally all of her limbs. So then she takes a whole bite out of the damn bamboo stick. <gasps> I've never seen so. Oh my god! Damn, that's Nezuko! But it's my first time seeing this. Yeah, ah, ah, what is, who is this on my screen? That is not Nessico, bro. That's that's a grown woman. Yeah, ah, 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 damn. Hold on, hold on now. What we missing? We missing something, bro. Everybody be telling me to check out the new Demon Slayer season. <laughs> I might have to have to see this bitch on my screen, bro. Hold on now. I got a little too excited. I don't know who I thought I was, bro. Bro, bro. I ain't gonna lie to you. Nezuko looks great, though. All jokes aside, Nezuko looks god damn. Nezuko looks mm, scrumptious, man. How old is she again? Jesus Christ. Look at this absolute menace. menace. Nigga, look at she her. Got veins in her forehead. Her forehead is popping. Like, what the? F what type of crack did this just snort? So then it's not crack. Oh my, Plot armor. Yeah. oh my goodness. She broke her back, bro. Sound like a door creaking open. <laughs> Nigga, ho, ho, foot is in she was back. moaning, bro. Yeah, she liked it. Staring at her like shit. I know your back ain't been blown out like this before, has yeah. it? Blow her back out again. Again. And straight up breaks her arm in half. Nezuko, what? Smiling. What's going Yo, on with you? Nezuko, what's going on with you? You're making me scared. Shit out of this are you enjoying this? Than a oh my god, bro. Her head is bouncing off the ground. But then Daki loses, so she just slices up her entire body. But bro, her she grows it back. Holding her together <gasps> and, and then she just started burning her ass. So then she Yo, she's enjoying this, y'all. Jumps up to high oh, heaven yes. and just straight plants her face oh, into this the this ground. This is and then she just starts stomping her out again. She's, she's not using her hands. hands. She's she just like stomping her ass. Is over. Just let the bitch quit. Menezico was like, nah, nigga, I ain't done yet. So then she gets her Yo. up. Yo. rough for the kick and just... I got one thing to say. Don't fuck with Nezuko and her family. I don't have friends. I got family. Bro, she's not playing no games right now. I'm actually excited to see this new season. Goddamn. Boots the bitch. Oh my goodness. 
But no, nah, no, nah, we didn't think he'd get even worse for Doki. Right? It got worse for her? So while Tanjiro was trying to calm Nezuko down, Doki's trying to get back up and trying to land a hit on her. Did you not Doki's learn your lesson? Oh my goodness, this guy. Tanjiro, Doki's like, ooh, a Hashira, you came to fight, nigga? This is a pretty one, the pretty Shut Hashira. Your ass up. I ain't got time for your weak ass. So then she starts talking, and then her whole head just falls off. In just He's a, a split demon. of a second, this man He's stopped her whole attack and straight up decapitated the bitch. So while she's complaining about why she's an upper six, I'm thinking like, uh, so why is your literal head in your fucking hands right now? You Bro, this animation is hilarious. Started crying. Hey, yo, this girl was talking all this. Like There's no way you're ago, upper six, now bro. Now she's crying her ass off. Hey, but you know what? Watching this ass whooping taught us all a lesson. What it teaches, bro? Never judge a book by its cover. Yeah, because Nezuko is not playing no games. Class could have some hands and some black forces in his backpack. Nezuko is not playing no games, bro. Great segment. I love Nezuko. The Tenjo Tenge Lunchroom Agni Kai. So while Masataka and Bob are having lunch, Nagi comes in and he wants to Yo, smoke. Yo, why is this like Yu-Gi-Oh and Beyblade put mind, together? Bro, what the fuck Nagi's is this? Nagi's only been at this school for two fucking days. And he already trying to run somebody's fate on the second day of school. Is so he, he built like that? Punch, but bro stops it with the chopstick. A chopstick? Oh my exactly goodness. And he so everybody clears out the lunchroom. Push his guts in. They about to have a straight Agni Kai. God damn, how old is this kid? What the fuck? He like, bro, it's only your second day and you're already starting shit so then he says all right bro since you were first here i'll give you a handicap all you gotta do is land one hit so nagi runs in and gets kicked in the temple hmm. and then bro just started blasting damn this nigga started doing taekwondo in his ass with the helicopter kick and just straight up teeing off on bro he has yo this is whole warren <laughs> look at bob bro he like damn my nigga getting his ass ripped. <laughs> so then somehow soichiro gets up from that shit so bro comes in flying with another kick but then we bro ducks under it on some okay Steve fox type shit Okay. And he throws a punch, but he grabs the punch uh, midair and uh, gets a whole spin on that nigga. And mm. bro's out cold. It's over. Wait a minute, is this again? I might want to see like, this. You really gonna get your ass Who the fuck is that on screen? Who's that? Who this? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Anybody got her as a waifu? Because I'm, I'm actually interested. Who is this? Who is this? What's her name? Because why is she built like that? How old is she again, bro? I, I, I gotta stop asking about these. I gotta stop talking about these females in these animes. Because whole time they be like 12, and I just be like. <laughs> really gonna get your ass whooped in front of all these niggas. You sorry as hell with that fake ass Super Saiyan cut you got going on, my boy. So talk to you. I don't know who he looks like, but he looks right so familiar. This man is ready to beat this nigga to a pulp. Nigga like, this is the first day I want him to whoop a nigga's ass so bad. So then he throws a punch where bro ends up stopping his punch with a lunchbox. And straight huh? up just cheap shots him. But everybody like, hey, 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 my boy, you shouldn't have done that. Technically, technically. All he said was, if you punch me one time, you land a punch, you win. So whatever happens next, he's cheating. The, the other guy's cheating. He landed his punch, the fight is over. He won. Mm-hmm. Yep. Hey, my boy, you shouldn't have done that shit. It, it, yeah, my nigga, I ain't even gonna lie. He, he should have not done that shit. What so happened, then, CJ? Bro, he just started yeah, damn, damn, Jesus damn. Jesus Christ. <laughs> boy, hit that nigga with the HR grab 64 bombs. They trying to get him off, but he like, got the way, nigga. Yo, he's throwing Dog people. dug his own grave. Yo, he picked him up? Picks up huh. his lifeless Please don't hit him again. Please don't hit him again. <gasps> oh my God, bro. That nigga's breakfast is gone. Just oh. look at this. Bro didn't awaken the demon. So then he throws a kill shot and it's over. The, the screen just The screen turned black. black. What that, happened? That nigga's dead. So later on, we cut to him sitting He's on dead. top of his roof. And He's right there. Like, damn. I really got my ass whooped on the second day of school. For sure. You got your he ass beat the fuck up. And it was in front of his girl, too. Hey. You got yo, cucked, my boy. Bro. Nah, bro. That's it. That's disrespectful as shit. <laughs> That's almost, that is almost as bad as the, what's that called? That's almost as bad as the high school DXD scene, bro. When that dude slapped the, slapped the dude's girl in front of him. Understand what you're <laughs> It's horrible, bro. If someone slapped my girl in front of me, bro, he has to die. Simple as that. He has to die. All right, next up on the list is Adam smoking Ricky's pack. So Ricky challenged Ricky Adam, Kawahara? who was basically a love child between Dio and Hisoka, and the kid looked up to Tony Hawk. And this man does one of the what anime is this? Special things you could ever do to anybody. So the race starts. So Ricky, you've seen this anime, CJ? Adam what is, is this? How many animes do you watch? What do you do with your life? This nigga pulls out a whole pack of black and miles and starts smoking that shit. That's a cigarette, my guy. That's a pack of Newports. Ain't no I know Newports when I see them. them. This nigga just straight monologues for about two minutes talking about how good his black and miles are. So after he's done with his smoke break, he picks up his board and just starts Naruto running. Nigga went from zero to 60 in a second and he is gone. And within five seconds, he's already on his ass. He's like, what up, little nigga? That's Jenga. In the head start I gave your ass. And this is 
Oscar still got the black and mild in his hand, bruh. Grabs onto him and just starts dancing on the skateboard. That's like, kind of tough. What the f is happening right now? Don't get nervous, Jenga. Pushes him down. Cannot tell me that's not Jenga, bro. Away from the ground. And look at him. He like, don't close your eyes, little nigga. You should save for this shit. So then Ricky passes him and does a nice ass little grind. So nice. Like, hmm, okay, I'll f with you, my boy. So he throws down the cigarette and Show hits this nasty ass Casper's like, God damn, my boy. Then this nigga does this pose and hits this called the love hug and he is skating <laughs> uphill. This nigga said, F the laws of physics, my boy. So that Ricky just went flying. Bro just ended up oh. rolling down the whole hill about like 50 yards. Jesus Christ, back on skate three, that is a fat ass going haul of meat. Hey, but no, 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 no. This man wasn't even done yet, bro. Because while I'm talking about this anime, I got to add one more thing. Talk to us, talk to us. So they're having this tournament and Adam is racing Cherry right now. And Cherry is actually beating him right now because I ain't even gonna lie, bro. His board is like actual cheats. So then Adam pulls in front of him and Show then this nigga moves. just starts tap dancing on his damn board. So yeah. Harry says, don't get too cocky, nigga. But Adam's like, nah, don't be too optimistic, motherfucker. So then he gets off his board, runs up at him, and slaps the nigga with the board. He said, get out of my face with that cheating ass board, nigga. Hit his ass so hard to replay three different times. Yo, what anime is this? What the fuck? Get out of my Yo, face why with is that there a fucking board, ninja nigga? on a ass freaking skateboard, bro? Do y'all see that ninja up there? That's a whole ninja on a skateboard, bro. What the fuck is going on in this show, bro? What the fuck? He's the nigga with the board. He said, get out of my face with that cheating ass board, nigga. Hit his ass so hard to replay three different times. And then while he's on the ground, he starts talking shit to him, and he says, yeah, the reason I never responded to your beefs is because, yeah, nigga, you born as shit. <gasps> Bro, getting called man, boring that's probably the worst that's probably the worst ever like don't say that to nobody that is me hawk pulling a butter knife on zoro so we all know zoro's dream he wants to be the greatest source one piece time. but to do that he's gonna have to get past this nigga i mean look how bro this vampire like ass nigga bro slayer. and look at him how pitiful weak one nigga you weak as hell and you sorry as hell but you know what i'll give you a handicap i'll pull out a fucking butter oh knife. yeah since they talk about this i seen this dude uh -huh. i'm no beast that goes all out when hunting a rabbit so i'm Unfortunately, he this is the smallest shit. shit I got. Yo, Ooh. pack it up, my nigga. Like, dog, back in the talking day, shit. Dude, this was the craziest. This man got three swords and it got stopped by a butter knife. So three like, swords down. I got oh, nigga, I'm out of my and stopped by a prairie, knife. Prairie, prairie, prairie all fucking day. So then Zora jumps up, but then he just gets stabbed. You got stabbed by a butter knife? Butter knife in it sent through shockwaves. So then he like, state your name, nigga. Rep your set. As courtesy of surviving so long, I'll actually pull out my real sword. So then we have our stereotypical enemy sword clash. Yeah, yeah, bro, yeah, bro. We knew he was He broke your that. sword, bro? Do that, bro? Hey, but even though this Farewell, is disrespectful as it made our boy who he is today. Because this man no doubt a menace. All right, ladies and gentlemen, uh -huh, it is uh -huh. finally time for another installment of the part most four, part moments in anime history. But today, we have something special. Because you see, this is not just a disrespectful video. Now, nah, we what are is it, also Mr. returning to the round table of black. Oh, I'm I? I'm I? I'm I? It is finally time for another installment of the most disrespectful moments in anime history. Uh -huh. But today, we have something special. Because you talk see, us, this is us. not just a disrespectful video. Nah, we are also returning to the round table of oh, it's Black two and one, two and one, two and one. Because a new challenger is on the horizon the to be judged and to take his seat at this round table of menaces. But ladies okay. and gentlemen, please rise as it is time to praise the sun. I'm here. Because Escanor has finally arrived to take his seat. Oh, yeah. Like this man's arrogance oh, is yeah. just straight up unmatched. The pride. He literally go zero to 100 in a second. Yeah. This man is so prideful, Talk so to him. arrogant. Just straight you hear that in the background? I just Play to, to him. His own episode. So y'all already mm. know we got the evidence on He's yet. at the but pinnacle of all things. Evidence, we have to give a shout out to our <laughs> he sponsor is the that is sponsoring this trial today, and that would be NordVPN. NordVPN is one of the easiest VPNs to ever use. With NordVPN, that is my download and upload speed right now, CJ. I don't need that. <laughs> Fuck is you talking, nigga? <laughs> Since we're doing spawn. <laughs> Since we're doing sponsors, you know what I'm saying? Huh? Since we're doing sponsors, you feel me? <laughs> the link is in the description for my sponsor. Fuck is you talking? Let me get a little swig of this real quick. Discount in a whole This nigga spelled bacon. discount so hella wrong. Make sure y'all protecting to be safe out on the internet and use NordVPN. I don't, I just use Incognito for what I need to be doing. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? All right, cut this out. And again, thank you, NordVPN, for sponsoring this video. But, ladies and gentlemen, uh -huh. without further ado, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <clears throat> clear throat. I need you to talk to us, man. <clears throat> now, ladies and gentlemen, 
I now present to you Exhibit A, uh -huh. bodying the Ten Commandments. So all, while Bonnie Lane and Jericho are on the run from Galen and Meliskula, they end up falling into a ravine and they're trying to find a place to hide. So mm -hmm. they end up mm -hmm. finding this cave and they see this door. So they talk walk to him, in the door and they end up finding a tavern with this dude. So when you bro, watch I did this not for expect the first him to be somebody like screen, crazy. Like, who is this skinny ass? Yeah. And bro is scared. He's like, hold on, hold on, holy night, nah, G. Hold on, I'm not trying to get arrested today. So then he starts talking to Bond, and Jericho's like, wait a minute, you know this skinny ass nigga? Hold on, hold on, cuz something is off. So he ends up hiding them in his pantry. So then Gallon and Meliskula pull up. Yo, this part crazy. Bricks right now. So they end up getting wasted in his tavern, and they like, ooh yes, we like you, cuz. Shoot, when we wipe out the dude, we gonna keep you alive. But then they like, alright, bro, give it up. We know them is hiding in that pantry. But then Gallon's like, you know what? Let's play a game. If you win, I'll let them a slide. Uh -huh. All you have to do is literally have a turn-based battle with me. Bro uh -huh. literally Talk wants on. to have an actual Pokemon battle with this man. And if Shut you run away, up. you turn into stone. So dude just straight up slaps him and he is out uh, cold. And Gal uh, like, damn, I thought I only tapped a little on the shoulder. <laughs> Sorry ass. Yes. I so was not expecting this next part, bro. Morning and the Look at this. Sun is up. And homie is still laid out. So then Gallon is looking at this wall and he sees this ginormous axe. So he ends up trying to pick it up. He but can't he pick can't it up, right? And lift it. On some Thor like, type damn, shit. This heavy ass ass. What the fuck is this mule near or some shit? And then this boy about to he rise. He's it about right to out rise. Of his hand. I was like, nigga, get your filthy ass hands off of my damn axe. Mm. I'm sorry for y'all niggas because y'all came Woo. all the way here just to die. Talk to him. Talk to him. Death. Mm, on, so disrespectful. They ain't even taking them serious. He's like, nah, I'm a human, I right. But the thing is, I stand above demons. I stand above gods. I stand above everybody. I He's will the pinnacle. Step on your ass. He's the so pinnacle. Finally see I, love, this I, love, I love Eskinor. My God, this man is prideful, all right? Yeah, he is prideful. Mm, look at that man. I'll be prideful too if I look like that. Pounds just it's so sus like i just can't stop being this nigga bro i'm that nigga like i am the sus god at this point bro clip that and put that in y'all compilation man i don't care man look at him look at him bro you know through all my years of youtube i really admire the art of anime you know what i'm saying like male female it don't matter who you are Bro looks like he put on at least about 500 pounds just worth of pure raw muscle. And his whole personality just took like a whole 180 turn. Dog's like I had to take off the light up sketches and throw on the black one, so what's good? So mm -hmm. Gallon's like, oh, you bold, bold. You the most arrogant bastard I've ever Look met. Look at the way he's looking Gallen at him, bro. Laughing at Eskimos, like, <laughs> That's why he laughs. Yes, yes. Get out of my face. Yeah, that just happened. He just chopped him in half with no warning at all. So Gallon yeah. reattaches himself. And he's like, "Ooh, yes, I like this, my boy." So then Eskimo Ooh, yeah, says, I like yeah, him, my boy. I basically kind of held back on you because uh, there's no point in one-shotting you because that's no fun. So Dog gets pissed off because he's basically just talking out reckless. So then he charges up to full power and he's like, "All right, then you want to talk that hot shit?" So be it. So bro, isn't this part crazy? Yeah. Power, like, Wait, what happens here? Have split. So we gotta be thinking. I think okay, he just okay, stands this man there. Gotta be dead, right? Oh yeah, he does. Right. This man is still standing here, and he only scratched him. Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Bro, that has got to be the most humiliating way to ever die, bro. You wait, wait, ended wait. up dying playing your own game with your own dumb ass stipulations that you made with it. And Escanor talking heavy right now. He like, and I don't blame him. I mean, it was against me. So then he's looking at Ogre. Talking and he's like, reckless. Uh, so I don't hit females, so I'll give you a choice. This next part is about to be so, if he shows it, it's about to be so crazy, bro. Like, this man is hot. <laughs> You get it, guys? No? Okay. Uh, so I don't hit females, so I'll give you a choice. You can escape or you could die. Just pick. But then she ends up activating her DSLs and she's like, He said the DSLs. So she just straight up snatches this man's soul and straight up eats. Oh my god, her, you know her to hurt. You know, you know them DSLs go crazy, y'all. Y'all see the way she just snatched that man's soul and then gobbled it up. You know what I'm saying? No, no Cardi B, no, no Megan Thee Stallion, but god damn. <laughs> Straight up snatches this man's soul and straight up eats. You see that tongue? My tongue go crazy. This man's soul is so hot. It literally starts frying her insides. Looking like she just ate a whole bag of talkies and ghost pepper chips. Bro, yeah, she's got her insides straight up burnt. Deep fried her and turned her into a piece of charcoal. And she Damn. is done. GG's. 
So How he get his soul back, though? Bond and he's like, listen, my boy, it's almost noon, so you stay your ass here, and that's an order. <laughs> bro, man ain't even a captain, and he giving orders. Hey, yo. Oh, nah, bro. This man's different. So after this, Escanor decided to just take a little that's side crazy. quest. So I love So we ended up fighting Gother and just straight up slapped him from playing with his ah. memories. Then after this, he just straight up one shot of Gothini and drove. Then look at him. He like, next time you play with my memories like that, I'm gonna slap the f out of you. So later on, the Ten Commandments launch a full attack <laughs> on Leonis. And everybody is paralyzed because of Esterosa's commandment, which is basically anybody that stands before him literally like cannot move. They can't attack him or anything. Escanor's big ass walking, is walking up. right up towards this walking up. Hold on, hold on. Why are you moving right now? Ah. Why should I bear any hatred towards somebody weaker than my oh. I feel his pity. Oh. So is right up in his face, and he's like, yeah. Your pack gonna be hit real good tonight, boy. Talk your ass. Says, Please don't harbor any hatred towards me. If you would be stricken by the own effects of your commandment, then it wouldn't be any fun for me. He's <laughs> talking spicy. Said, hey, yo, you better watch your own powers, bro. Who might end up backfiring on you. Like a dead gallon, cause y'all not safe around this nigga. Ask nobody safe, nigga. Not even me. I'm true God, nigga. I'm become true Escanor food. I don't know, nigga. You don't eat me. I don't. Hey, I don't know. I might let Escanor. He said, hey, yo, you better watch your own powers, bro, because that might end up backfiring on you from being face to face with me. Yo, this uh, man is uh, a demon. Uh, Esterosa just socks him. And Eskimo's like, oh, so it's like that then. And then he just he sucker him all ass. the way down. And then he kicks him all the way up like a damn elevator. Mm -hmm, and just straight mm -hmm. up comboed his ass. Uh huh, uh huh. And we like, damn. He getting his ass beat right now. But dude is, it, is, is it a new? The punch and he blocks it, but the punch oh, was so shit. strong, it drops him. Dog's like, oh, what's wrong? Did a coin fall on the ground or some sh Don't tell me that little weak ass punch I just threw just knocked the wind out you. So then they end up down again, there. But he ends up using a full counter on him. So while mm -hmm, Esteros mm -hmm. is explaining his ability, Esteros this is against is physical account. His That's all attacks. Like, wow, no wonder I actually felt pain from that. It was my own strength. So he charges up. This man said, I'm quite like, hmm, amazing. I guess I got to get serious myself now. So he just straight up blasts his Dude literally was launched this, uh, him all the way to the lake. this move call? Something sun or something like that? Just riding the sun looking down at him like, hmm, you really thought you ate that shit, didn't you? Bum ass nigga. So then cool he just son. straight up slams this sun in his face and drills this all the way to the bottom of the lake. And dog this said, man no, I'm not drills. even done yet. So then he blows it up and it just straight up evaporates it entirely. And he is walking towards him without a care in the world right now. Oh my gosh. He technically just deep fried him he in the is lake. really so going crazy. Again, but Esterosa ends up using a full counter and looks like he just blasted his entire face off. So mm -hmm, Esteros mm -hmm. thinks Talk he's me, already one. He's like, yeah, I'm smoking your pack tonight, cuz. All nah. that muscle for nothing. You sorry as hell. But oh boy. <laughs> Talk to us. Is it noon? Is it about to be noon? It's noon. It's noon. Stand on a, the pinnacle, nigga. Stand up. Wait, open. And uh huh. Starts talking. He's Talk like, to him. <laughs> I'm sorry. You yeah. really thought you ate? Do that. Who decided, Who decided that? that? Uh huh. You thought this was over. Who, Who decided, decided that? that? Uh huh. Ass, nigga. I decide when this is over. Yo. Dogs like, do yourself a favor. Got my face. So he just sends some flying bullets. I love this part, bro. Soldiers comes in and tries Trying to, to help. Stop it, bro. Nah, nah, They're nah, nah. Gone. So they both go adios. Say goodbye. Why would you try to help against a guy like that, bro? I wouldn't even try to fight really this man, Escanor. Look at him. Yeah, that was exactly. Isn't he like tallest time when he gets in that to, uh, 12 p.m. form? B. Four power, whatever you want to call it. This man is right, crazy. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you. How you that prideful and like exhibit can B back it up? Exhibit B consists of running Meliodas' pockets and embarrassing a god. So as we can see right now, Meliodas has lost his damn mind. Yeah, he so on some other shit right now. Hmm, looks like I gotta clean up the little boy's mess. So he tells Merlin to trap them both in this cube. So while Meliodas is in his assault form, bro is talking mad heavy right now. Bro's like, the Shut animation on this is kind of weird. Lowly human. So Eskinor is looking at him like, hmm, so you wanna fight, boy? So Eskinor, look, is look like, how tall yeah, he I'm is, bro. Right now because I can finally prove while I'm better than you. Look at Ooh. your whack. Look at your animation quality. What? So they start swinging so Meliodas. Yeah, he is ugly right now. Let it rip. So Meliodas ends up stabbing Escanor, and Bro ends up falling back. What? So everybody's like, ain't no way this boy what? is lost. But Merlin's like, nah, what? G, hold on, hold on. Just a few more minutes. So Escanor gets up and he's like, wow, that actually kind of stunk. You pretty strong, my boy, but obviously second to me. He better get taller, bro. This man is getting bigger, <laughs> bro. He has no neck. Meliodas ends up punching him in the chest. 
And he puts his nasty ass low budget stink ass feet on his face. Low like, budget on, stink ass feet. So they continue feet. to scrap. So Melio just swings, but his sword ends up getting stopped by this man's muscles. So I was like, get this weak ass butter knife off me. So then they start swinging, but <laughs> Damn. Melio ends up using this man as a human pinball. So Melio just thinks it's over, but ho oh, oh. ho. Who decided that? Look at the time. It's time. Oh my god! Oh. What's about to happen? It looks like a fusion. Oh, it's called the one. It's called the one. So then Meliodas attacks him and slices him about a thousand times. Uh -huh. Bro turns uh -huh. around and looks at him like, wow. He said that itchy. Tickles. So he uses his hand, cuts the literal air, and it one shots him. <laughs> Nigga hit him what? with a divine chop. So then he's looking down at him like, how does it feel? How does it feel to get looked down on by a human? Talk you your ass, nigga. Even Talk though his animation quality is ass, it still oh. didn't stop me from whipping your ass. Oh my god, bro. He just bodied this man, beat oh him so gosh. bad he made him look like a Roblox custom created character. <laughs> Why? Did they think it was a good idea to upload this to, you know what I'm saying? Like, what, what? How did this get approved, bro? One more time, one more time. How did this get approved, y'all? How did this get approved? Like, who approved this? Who said it was okay to... <laughs> Bro, this shit is so ugly, like... <laughs> I feel like I can do better than this, bro. Like, who... Who drew it? had to be somebody's little daughter, bro. It, it can't be no way that someone that's getting paid drew this and thought it was a good idea. They... they, they <laughs> Later on, Escanor's walking down this alleyway with Hawk. And I ain't gonna lie, Mans is acting hella down bad right now. Mans is like, oh, Lady Merlin, let me get them cheeks. Hey, Mer Merlin go kind of crazy. All I ask. So while this is happening, the Archangels are getting drunk off their ass. And Lodosio's like, my God, what is this presence? Is this a drink hitting? So then he flies outside. He's like, hey, yo, big and fat ass. What y'all doing out here, man? Then Escanor's like, oh my, Princess Margaret has been taken over by a so then he jumps up and he's like, <clears throat> pardon me, but uh, it disgusts me to be looked down on by someone smaller. So allow me to reintroduce myself. This man went from the lower ground to the higher ground because the angel that had his body taken over was looking down. So he rose up, but that's how you, that's some boss ass stuff right there. That's some boss ass stuff, bro. Imagine someone on like a flight of stairs looking down, talking to you, you go up. A bit, you go up to another flight of stairs just so you could be higher than them, just so you could be like, yo, I don't like the way you was talking down. Even if you just looking down on my direction, bro. From now on, whenever I'm talking to females that's taller than me, I'm wearing heels. I swear to God, you're not about to look down on me, bro. Like, bro, I'm tired of everybody saying I'm short and you know what I'm saying? Like, bro, I'm not fortunate enough to have the height like y'all, but God damn it, I'm gonna start wearing heels. Fuck it. Like, that's the only solution I got, bro. I can't like... The fuck supposed to do grow inches of shit, bro? <laughs> I got enough inches, you know what I mean, nigga? <clears throat> let's get back into professional mode. You know, let's get this video done. <clears throat> Pardon me, but uh, it disgusts me to be looked down on by someone smaller. So allow me to reintroduce myself. My name is Escanor. Pleasure to meet you, bitch. <laughs> Yo, the audacity on this man. Dude really had to take the high ground to assert his dominance over a god. So Ludosio starts attacking him. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this man is just straight up slapping his sword away, bruh. Dog is looking at him like, uh, bitch, can I help you? So he starts <laughs> swinging again and dude is weaving weave, 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 dog. Weave. I was like, can you please calm down? You can't to touch him, you, bruh. Man. So we grab Slap him, her. but he escapes and he ends up chopping up his whole shirt. So then Ludosio basically says, all right, listen, my boy, uh, you got my brother's power, so uh, I'm gonna need you to run your pockets. But then Eskimo points at her and he's like, shut your stupid ass up. I ain't relinquishing shit. You know what, matter of fact, run your fucking pockets, So Sunshine so is like- straight up <laughs> evaporates his sword. He's like, you should be grateful I'm slept out of your dumb ass for running up on me like that. Ugh, the king of arrogance strikes again. So yeah, that was He needs to become an art angel, bro. But he can't, he's too prideful. <clears throat> and he wins, bro. He's like the best of exhibit all kinds. <laughs> the pinnacle, like real tall. Like, I'm about to give him some pin. Mm. Exhibit C consists of poking Zeldris and jumping the Demon King. 
So as we can see, Ludosio Merlin and Escanor squaring up with Zelda's Cusack and Chandler right now. Oh, this is kind of <laughs> hot. Looking down at this man, bro. Looking down at him like he's about to discipline his child or something. <laughs> yeah. While they're fighting, Zelda's uses this move, and it's like a literal vacuum. So what everybody's getting oh, black hole. And look how nice, this nice, man nice. anchors himself down. Oh my God, yo, this man is just a straight giga. Bro, yeah, say, he I'm can do anything, bro. Inch. So Ludosio ends up getting stuck on Escanor's that man, back. That, that man said, <laughs> you thought she was going to take me? Who decided that? Bro, that is the best meme of all time. Because really, who decided that? I'm <laughs> bro, say, I'm not moving an inch. So Ludosio ends up getting stuck on Escanor's back. And look at him. He's like, wow, you need a piggyback ride or some shit? So Ludosio's asking for help, but Escanor's like, nah, G, I'm good. Matter of fact, what gives you the authority to give me orders? So Ludosio's like, who the hell do you think you talk to, nigga? I'm a god. And bro's like, nah. uh, okay, congratulations. Don't hurt him. Don't Sorry, hurt him. Sorry, I don't obey weak niggas. But then Merlin's like, bro, just help the bitch. So then he grabs her like a toy. He's like, all right, then uh, you better have a good plan or else I'm going to let your ass go right here, right now. But then they end up getting slammed into a wall again. So then Escanor's like, all right, yo, I I'm uh -huh. sick of this. I'm about to discipline this boy. So this Talk to him. gets up and he is straight up walking through the vacuum. And Mez is talking heavy right now. He's saying first Meliodas, then Esterosa, and now yo bitch ass. My, my, looks like I got a body the whole family now. Mm. And Zelda's talking. The whole family saying, lineage. No, I ain't like them. I'm built different. And mm. Esterosa just laughs at him. And he's like, shut up, boy. So he slams his axe into him, but his axe ends up cracking. I was like, you know what, bro? I don't even need the axe. So we just straight up chucks the axe. And Zeldris is like, hmm, you've laid down your weapon. You must have accepted death, haven't you? But Eskimo is like, nah, nigga. Who decided I'm gonna death? For your ass. So he gives him the divine shot. And oh my god, look at Zeldris, bro. He's like, oh my god. Oh my god. It's bro. only using a hand. So Zeldris steps back. I would have gave up a long time like, nah, ago. Bring that ass here, boy. So he hits this man with the divine poke and straight up pokes him. He's got poked, y'all. That right there might be one of the most disrespectful things in just history. Getting Imagine poked like that. fighting somebody and they beat you by poking you to death. No, yeah, bro, I would never show my face again. So after this, Eskinor actually ended up losing his like power that. of sunshine. And the Demon uh, King is attacking. And this little thing is licking this man up right now. Like, Jesus Christ. But then Mael comes down and saves him. So then Eskinor saying, all right, listen, bro. I need sunshine back. But Mael's like, uh, you know you will die if you get this power back, right? But bro's like, ah, if I get to run the hands with the Demon King before I die, then so be it. So while they're fighting the demon, this man comes out of nowhere and stops his sword with his hand. He got it and back. I'm like my my, yes, hello yes, bootleg yes, Sephiroth. Yes. How nice, are you? Nice. See, today is not Niggas your lucky have day bootleg because uh, look at the time. It's twelve. Um, and yeah, this yeah, man yeah, is yeah, talking yeah. heavy. Man's like, you whack ass demon. I can't wait to beat the brakes off of your ass. So then he tells everybody to stay out of this. This okay. is my fight and my okay. fight only. So they both just start swinging. My oh, God. God. Straight up rock them, sock them. Then he just smashes this is like watching, This is like watching <laughs> Roman Reigns versus uh, Brock Lesnar, bro. Them niggas are really fighting. Don't punch soft as hell. So they keep on scrapping. And then he turns into like this ginormous flaming Super Saiyan. Nigga, like in nigga that's uh. Uh, that's uh that's endeavor y'all that's endeavor really forgot that man's name mm -hmm. second 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 place hero <laughs> second hero not not the strongest all my all my number one number two hero flaming super saiyan nigga like infernate so we get back to the fight and this man is just eating all of his punches to the face bro it's over bro it's over call it a day <laughs> bro any man that's just the bro i'm not heads. fighting no nigga like so, I mean, bro pride bro i'm done backstory. yeah yeah this man was a menace straight up slap meliodas and bond and then he ran out and just literally beat up an entire mountain so we get back to the fight and meliodas hey. is getting mad on him he's like bro you really ain't gonna let us jump in with you come on dog at least let us get a few licks in so he just said all right then so they just jumped him and yeah that was basically raps after that and then yeah you know after this eh, the worst part of this show happened dog Talk i ain't even gonna lie to y'all one of the only reasons i even watched this show was because of this man dog said sorry y'all i gotta ascend to the round table all right, P. Yeah, i mean at least he got the smooch at the oh, end though oh yeah, my sorry, god people. I mean, he, I mean, he ain't get the smash though. You think he smashed Merlin? Man, I, if I died without smashing Merlin and I like was that close to her, mm, I'd be disappointed in life. Man, at least he got the smooch at the end though. Yeah, but R.I.P. to really to do it, man.
All right, Peter, so go. After all that evidence, bro. Just come in, take your seat, just sit your ass down. Just the plain up arrogance and just the absolute zero to one hundred switches, nah, bro. There, there, there should be no question. So yeah, that's basically it. Uh, make sure y'all go sub to the second channel. We're actually starting Elden Ring this week. Also Yuck. follow you on IG and Twitter, and uh, I'm out of here. What's good, y'all? Welcome back to another reaction video, and today we got some CJ the Champ. But this time we got CJ the Champ. Yeah, chilling, eating some motherfucking Jello, bro. What's up with you and Jello, bro? Shit, good, bro. The fuck? That's like your favorite snack. Yes. This is your fifth installment on Disrespectful Woman's. How do you feel about this one? I ain't gonna lie. Uh, uh you know what I'm saying? I don't know, bro. I'm gonna be honest with you. I don't know, nigga. <laughs> I've told you before, but like, I know you stole this from Breezy. What the uh the uh the the footage screen? Yup. Yeah. I know you. Almost definitely, nigga. <laughs> I needed something from the contract. So I was like, fuck. Where's that fucking screen that Berlizzi used to use? I'm like, yeah, I found it, nigga. This, hold on. This is the exact one? This is the exact Oh, no. <laughs> 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 this nigga ain't changed at all, bro. This nigga took the exact one, bro. Nah, nigga. Hey, it worked, though. It worked. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. So he brings this man to the fight. What so the then fuck? he says, all right, my boy, oh, class boy, is in bro. session. Today we will bro, be learning nice how to boy, beat bro. his ass 101. I, I, I would like, like to thank boys. our volunteer right here. Uh, I don't even know his name, but he <laughs> will be used as a demonstration <laughs> today. I beg your pardon. That nigga is disgusting. <laughs> Hold on, bro. Oh, bro you got to You got to Come on. I know you know what I'm about to ask you, right? I'm not saying it, bro. Come on, bro. Please, please. It's like one note. One note, bro. Come on. The people are going to love it, bro. I'm not singing this shit. <sighs> Y'all can imagine it in your head. This is not no fun at all, bro. You don't want to sing the song, bro. Finally, time for another installment of the most. We're here. We're here. Number five. Number history. five. The series that we observe. Oh, what the, the hell? Most outrageous, most outlandish <laughs> moments to ever be seen by the human eye. That just make you look at the screen. What's up like, with these pictures, bro? I can be finding random pictures on Google Images, and I'll just be like saving them, bro. First up to the plate is Sukuna being a dog. So Itadori and Fushiguro are fighting this ugly ass. What the hell is what that? What the f is that? Oh my god. Jesus Christ, bro. That is just ugly. So Itadori tells Fushiguro, all right, listen, bro. I'm just going to have to let that doll come out. So Sukuna comes out and he's like, hey, what's good with you, cuz? So the curse bags okay, up and see. he's like, oh, hell no. Nah. Who is this thug ass? Nigga? So then he starts talking to him like, boy, I tell you, boy. He tapped that man on the shoulder. The you supposed to be a oh, fish, God, a barnacle man, nigga. A doll. He jumps back and starts charging up. Is that a Hadouken? So bro shoots it, but he just stops it with Damn. Huh? Mm. Then he looks at him and says, oh, this what Hold on, that, right that was it? That was it? That's yeah, all you yeah. needed to do? That's all I added in was this green screen right here. Are you serious? Wow. Why why can just change this? You don't even know. He looks it. at him and says, You ugly lip. All you just see is like this old filter. Boy, I, I, I told you, bro. I told you. I said all you gotta do is add a filter, bro. That's all I said all, is add a filter. I'm glad it I'm wasn't like, like no crazy ass filter where we were like niggas would have been like, uh, but nah, that shit was solid. That was solid. You know, shout out the true guy, you know what I'm saying? I hope the nigga out. <laughs> Uh, yeah, yeah. You just hating, bro. You hating because you know my shit work, nah. He looks at him and uh, says, "You yeah, ugly that. lip, motherfucker, <laughs> boy, I oughta beat your ass." So I just damn. Keeps planting him into the ground. Then he starts looking at him like, "Damn, cuz they no just pants, started and your bro. ass already on you the ground." You know how they be doing. They be trying to show the features. Those dogs stepped on him. So then he tries to grab him, but he rips his arm off. Dude said, damn boy, that gorilla grip that fast? fired on your ass. And yo, he's <laughs> laughing while he is doing this. Yo, this man is a demon. So later on, while he is continuing to torment this thing, the curse comes the down and starts laughing at him. So he starts boy. looking at him like, why you got that big ass grin on your face? You think shit is sweet or something? Good mm. fat boy, I'll show you what's sweet. So then he hits him with the domain expansion. Is that what it's called for real? Like, how does that work? Uh, I know since they told me that everybody has it. A domain expansion? Yeah. You gotta like just learn how to do it and shit. So like, who's your favorite character? JJK? Yeah. Probably that boy Toto. Doesn't he have an exception with woman? What's your favorite type of woman? Same as his type. Same type that he got. Fat ass. Big butts. <laughs> Fat ass. Fat ass. <laughs> got on my face. What the? That's really cold. That's really cold. Oh boy, turn this man into a fish fillet cooked well done. So then he says, so I ain't going to come back out now. Hello, can you hear me, nigga? Uh, but then he gets drawing. no response, mm. so he's like, huh. you 
Look at that grin, that evil grin. About a minute later, he pops up right behind Fushi Girl. So he's like, what's good, cuz? Just to let you know, I'm about to beat your ass. Damn, I'm why? Your ass, I'm gonna eat this crusty ass finger. <laughs> CJ, what the hell is wrong with you? Bro. <laughs> I don't know, bro. I was just in the moment, bro. <laughs> that nigga turn into a. <laughs> I was in the moment. <laughs> the flavors are melting on my tongue. Oh nah, nah, CJ, what the <laughs> hell? <laughs> bro, I was in the moment, bro. Chill. You know I don't write scripts, bro. I, I, these become these be coming off the top of my head, bro. Yo, something is wrong with you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Flavors are melting on my tongue. Nah. Oh, salt on the door. I ain't gonna lie to you, boy. <laughs> now, time to beat your ass. So Fushy Girl we, starts swinging, we, but look at this man. He is bro, he's all of not his even fighting him for real. Where the hell oh, that hawk nah, come from? No. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> nah, nah, it's the hawk. Oh, nah, <laughs> you know Wait, the, who's, you know? whose animal is that? Uh, that's uh, Fushy Girl. I think that's, that's a, a bird. Owl. Oh, an owl? Oh, no, bro. That's how you don't even want to take his hands out. So he keeps on punching, so Sukuna's like, damn, boy, you can't hear shit. Come on, now, put your back into it. Oh, my God. Oh, boy, gave him the back oh, end boy. of the century. So Strong, bro. Right. Everything. He trying to jump him with the snake, the owl. He so, bro, bro got all the animals. Oh, my God. Oh, my God, so he got the animal kingdom down, on this side. Grabs him, and he says, come on, now, there's a whole world out there we got to see, nigga. Oh, my God. Bro, check his whole body. It's a whole new world. Why'd you pause me here, bro? What is wrong with you, bro? <laughs> you pause me here, bro. You ball it. <laughs> what is wrong with you, bro? <laughs> nah, bro. What is going on? <laughs> I told you, bro. I was in the. I was in a certain type of zone when I was recording this video. I don't know. Something was different about this one. You was on melatonin for sure, bro. Almost you was it. really talking. Oh, I, was, I, I was high off my ass making this shit. I don't lie to you. He said, a whole new world. <laughs> Yo, bro, check his whole body. He said, a whole new world. <laughs> then bro starts playing ping pong with him. Boom. Damn. Said, Come on now, get your sorry ass up. So as he was flying through bro. buildings, like, why did he do this? Oh, he bro, right he, behind he him and he like, so oh, ugly ass dude, Oh my Bell god. Oh. Damn, oh, he said, fuck Peter. Oh god, I mean, God, that beating didn't even make any sense. Look at my sense. boy Pumba. <laughs> he just beat this man for just for absolutely no, no reason. reason at all. Like, <laughs> damn. Oh my god, yo, this man is disgusting. Yeah, when the rest of this manga gets animated, homeboy is most definitely getting a full video. Shout out to him. Shout out to him. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Who next? Next up on the list next? is Gojo's PowerPoint presentation. So while bro is on the way to go meet the principal, yes. oh, he tells the driver, I think I know. I think I know what's about to happen. So you know why I said leaves, there's a reason says, I said PowerPoint. Right, you could come out now. He about to teach, bro, bro. This ugly yep. ass boy come from the top rope. Then dog said, "What's good, Nico? Get ready." <laughs> Don't stop on the video. Bro. Sorry, bro. It's just it's ugly ass oh boy come from the God. top rope. Then dog said, What's, What's good, good nigga? Go? Get ready to become a pack. So he starts throwing out. I gotta get rid of my stink meter. Video, at him. He came that sounded like stink meter for real. And then he decided to hit him with a gut check. So then uh. after all that, bro is squeaky clean. He has taken no damage at all. Bro so still got his head, man. What's wrong with blindfold? So then Gojo's like, You realize. You cannot hit me, right? So then he says, come here. Don't be Ew. shy. Come a little closer. Touch my hand. Touch my hand. So he tries to touch his hand, but he can't. Don't you got some long Gojo's fingers, like, huh? bro. The nah, those fingers go crazy. So then Gojo's like, you feel that? This is called my infinity, a.k.a. my plot armor. So do you want to know you are, buddy? my plot armor. Your fodder. Good God, bro. Go oh. Check the life out of this man. The my dog said, hold on. I ain't even done yet. Bitch, man. Damn. Damn. And he says, oh, you really thought you was going to see that long ass get finger, boy. That shit <laughs> was God. No. Oh, my God. Dog sent him flying. And look at him. He dragging that the down. Damn, bro. Like, get your bum ass out of my sight. Look at him. He dragging his dirty ass through the ground. This nigga like said his dirty ass. Gun. Then he comes from behind me. He's like, dirty ass boy. Sit look at him. He's dirty. Ass down. <laughs> oh, my God. Bro is gone. So then Gojo's like, oh. 
this is a perfect time. He better so get uh, bro, bro. Leaves, goes nah, bro. This man really go up and he's in like, there. Like, yo, do you want to watch me beat this nigga's ass? <laughs> So he brings this man to the Bro, fight. Look at him. So then he says, all right, my boy, class is in session. Today we will be learning how to beat a nigga's ass 101. I would like to thank our volunteer right here. Uh, I don't even bro, know. Bro, that's so name, disrespectful, bro. Imagine you I fighting know, somebody. Bro. That person go grabs a little, like, apprentice, and he, like, he watches you get your ass. <laughs> oh, God, bro. It's the fact that he really brought this, man, to literally watch him beat his ass. Be like, I want you to pay close attention because this man is so weak. I just want you to watch me beat his ass. Bro, mid-fight, like, too. Like, a, what would you, like, what would you do, bro? Like, what would you... <laughs> Uh, if somebody did that to me, I'll just fall over and just die. <laughs> like, that's disrespectful as fuck. Like, bro, you ain't had to do me like that. I'm sorry. Like, I, I'm I am sorry if that happened. <laughs> you go like you're just you're not gonna start apologizing. Apologizing? You're gonna give up and just fall over? I, I'm sorry. I'm just gonna fall over. Like, what am I gonna do? Give up the cheeks? Pause, but give up the Wait, cheeks. What? Alright. You are really nah, 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 CJ. Nah, nah. Cause you be trying to say that I be saying such things, but here, here, here lately you've been saying some questionable things. Oh bro, I'm about to say some such shit in a minute. Huh? Hey, stop playing with my name, nigga. But then go just like <laughs> your name, but you are weak. You're trash. I'm fucking I bet weak. you half of the people that watch this show don't even know your name. His name is like almost yeah, his name. Y'all. I don't even remember his name. Bro, I didn't know it. I, I for real didn't know it. I think it's Jogo. I had to look it up. Yeah, it's Jogo. Jugo? Jogo? Yeah, let's just go with Jugo. All I know is he looked like Squidward when he had the volcano. Jugo. Anyway. Ah, like, Stop playing with my name. So then he uses Stop his domain expansion and he done turned this bitch into Bowser's castle. So okay. Then Jojo's like, all right, UG, pay close attention. So bro takes off the blind. All right, pretty eyes coming out. With the domain expansion. Okay. Beautiful nigga void. Okay. That nigga is that nigga is beautiful. I ain't gonna lie. So bro's like, Ugh, what is this? Pause. But who is this beautiful ass nigga? Uh-huh. Well, then Gojo comes behind him and he's like, you know, man. That nigga tapped him on the head. Trust me. Oh god, bro. It. It's just it's well, a fact that and look how he headlock it, uh <laughs> you need to Tori, bro. <laughs> but uh let me put you out of your misery. <laughs> Oh my god. It's just how he just snatched it, bro. That nigga firmly grasped his head. Yeah, that nigga said, Yaga. Bro, he just ripped his head off with one hand. And to add to the disrespect, he stomped on his head. Look, like, oh. dog, the fact that he basically used this man as a punching bag to be an example oh, well, after he just TV tried cream. to sneak him I and think, he I left think, mid fight. You know. <laughs> bro, that's TV. disgusting. All right, ladies vintage. and gentlemen, our <laughs> next moment is more JJK. This uh, is uh, the Jujutsu kind Yeah, he was, he was, he was off one on this one, huh? Oh yeah, right. <laughs> I think it's more JJK. But anyways, Toto beating the absolute brakes off of Fushi Guru. Now you see, this moment isn't just this one was actually nah, supposed to be uh, this is Gon also versus one of the Pito, most but I just changed bad, it. horrendous. Why you take that one out? I want to say, I want to say for the next one. Toto beating the absolute brakes off of Fushi Guru. Now you see, this moment isn't just disrespectful. Nah, this is also one of the most down, bad, horrendously. Bro, that Kermit, that's Kermit, exists. so ugly. So Toto and my <laughs> pull up and they talking match. My said, heard your classmate died. Tell me, how hard She's is that pack? Bad. Let me, let me stop. So then Toto like, walks up oh. to Fushi Girl and he says, "Hey, boy." Yeah. What's your type? <laughs> Depending on the answer that you give me will determine if I beat the shit out of you or not. Bro, that what? boy got that demon back. Bro, what are you talking don't, about? Don't say that. I'm sorry. This up in has here. to be one of the most wildest things no, happened with Baki, I've right? ever heard come out of somebody's mouth. Oh, this God. This is determined to run this man's fade if he does not like the exact same girls that he likes. So then he's like, come on now, speak up. How you like him, nigga? Nah, for real, for real. If a nigga came up to me and was like, bro, I'm going to beat the fuck out you. What kind of girls do you like? And if you don't answer right, I'm gonna beat the shit out of you. I'm gonna be like, bro, I don't know. <laughs> I'll be honest with you, I do not know what to do. Fushi girl did the absolute worst thing you could possibly say, bro. I like him tall with a fat ass boy. Come on now, I ain't waiting all day. So he's like, fat all ass right, boy. Uh, hmm. as long as she has good character. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> <she's a pimp. laughs> so then Toto's like, is he crying? Oh, Yo, bro's taste. crying. <laughs> So we blitz this is man. Wait, what'd you say? You got bad taste. Huh? 
Oh, I'm fucking so he weak. This is man. Good God. Oh my oh, gosh. Then he walks up to him and says, I knew it. Well, look at that boy body, bro. You a bitch what are you ass to say? nigga. Like it looks so good. So girl pulls out these uh, shut frogs. Shut the fuck up. I was just asking. You trying to get suplex caught up, bro. <laughs> I'll just add Mario, man. This is a buff like ass nigga. nigga. You so you, it looks good to you. I'm trying to look like that. Face and <laughs> to the wall. He's, like, Hold He's on, beating the fuck out this nigga, yet. bro. He starts lifting this man up through the entire building. Good God. Yo, this is just brutal. Hey, to be so fire, come on now, fight back, nah, that be fire. We get it from. He's about to hit him again. Uh, I found a free for profit Detroit type beat. Chill out. Then Panda come in and he. Oh, who are these niggas? Toge has to come and hit him with. Who the fuck is this pretty ass nigga? Hey, yo, boy. Is he not pretty, CJ? Oh no, now, now, now you see, now you. This is how you gonna get traded. This is just like that one RDC video when the uh the media person like trying to uh get get you to say something, so your ass get canceled. Uh uh, fuck that nigga. How you gonna get canceled for saying that this anime character looks nice? No, 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 you gonna you gonna say some dumb shit? Nah, fuck that no, no, nigga. No. I'm leaving the interview right now, nigga. <laughs> I'm just asking. The I'm exiting the call right now. I'm just asking, you know, you got pretty eyes. I mean, <clears throat> purple eyes. I'm going to say purple. That time, I definitely meant to say purple. I promise you. So, as he's about to hit him again, Toge has to come and hit him with the chill out. Chill, chill out. out. Then chill Panda out. come in and he like, yo, what are y'all doing? The Panda Toto talks? Says, his taste is trash. Let me beat his ass. But he's like, ah, forget it. But next time I see your bitch ass, your taste better change, boy. Yo, the fact that this man Toto almost beat this man Fushi Girl to death. Yo, he's gotten beat up twice in that. one bit. Like, uh, oh, God, I'll put you going in his favor, bro. bro. basically <laughs> took your waifu is trash to the extreme. Ah, uh, oh. I'm just. Wait, wait, speaking of which, CJ, we got to ask you a question. Who is your favorite waifu? Uh, as uh, death. I ain't mad at it. I'm not mad at it. Our final moment. Probably, if not, one of the most disrespectful moments in ah, anime yes. history. This Perfect is... Cell violating Vegeta. Vegeta, man. Oh, now, this is when now, I remember, I, now when I was making this one, I was... No explanation. I was you know, gone when I got all, to this part, bro. These two buff, high as hell. ass niggas. Yes. Let's start off with this cocky bastard. <laughs> that Saiyan prior really had to kick in in full gear, huh? Bro, really this cocky let bastard. this man go absorb 18, and he was attacking. I mean, I, I recorded Damn. this at like 10 o'clock at night, bro. I'm in six says, during this huh, entire month. I recorded this part at like 10 o'clock at night, bro. 10 o'clock, though. Oh, and don't think I forgot about this bald bastard. This nigga was you horny. Good job, but you got horny. one little smooch. Horny. One little... I mean, Hook he, he knows know smashing, no, no, no. though. Was no, 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 that's the thing, though. That's the thing. Niggas always be talking about, well, at least Krillin got her in the end. Congratulations, bro. It still don't change the fact because of this fuck up that you did. Your best friend, your day one homie ended up dying for seven fucking years. Seven years? Niggas always be like, but, but, Krillin, at least he got with 18. I don't care. <laughs> None of this would have y'all could have ended the arc right here. This all this whole part of the cell saga just pissed me off. Vegeta was being There's, dumb. Oh, he was being oh. dumb. <sighs> oh God! And I'm not, I ain't even gonna take the fact, bro. This man Gohan was being dumb as hell when he was fighting Cell. Remember they blew that nigga up, and then Goku was saying to finish that nigga off, but Gohan was like, "No, I want to make him suffer." I'm like, Gohan, just kill him, bro, please. Puck on the cheek. And you was whipped into some cyborg coochie. Ah. I said, F the earth. She bad as hell. Man, oh man, did these decisions Shaking come head, to bite y'all in the ass. So after Cell absorbed 18 and became perfect, bro is just glorified by himself. Every and time I see Cell, I hear all his sound effects. And look at Vegeta, dumbass. Wow, he looks less oh, yeah, intimidating. The, uh, the little, the God, little, I thought we uh, already learned this mm -hmm. lesson with Frieza. When they look wall. less intimidating, yeah. they're strong as f Damn, he so blew his So Krillin goes in and attacks this man. And bro, he ain't even paying him any attention. Yo, this imagine, boy, yo, bro. imagine it's fighting somebody. <laughs> I'm looking at him. He just looked at his head, bro. Him, and he is still Damn. paying him no attention at all. Why is he, he still looking at his head? This over dramatic ass nigga. Bro, ain't oh, no. <laughs> wow, I am fucking beautiful, the nigga. This man him, stared at his hand. No oh my at all. god. Then he ate the destructo disc. Then he turns around and he's like, So you want to play, little nigga? After I all that. Hold on, first of all, bro. I, I, after I realized none of my attacks was working, bro, I would have just left. I would have been like, Yep, you got it. Bye.
Exactly, bro. I'm not attacking him. Uh, first of all, no, Krillin's weak ass. Now, now you out here getting mad because you're like, oh, he absorbed her. You haven't even put your dick in her, bro. <laughs> come on, bro. Come on. I'll adapt everybody up and left. I'm like, y'all got it. Mm -hmm. I'll wait for Goku. I'll wait for Goku, <laughs> bro. Oh, God. I'll be like, I'll wait. Then he turns around and he's like, so you want to play little nigga? All right, then. Witness perfection. Look at him. He's skipping to him. Oh. And he gets up in his face and he's he like, kick him. boo. Then boo. bro yep, I know. Neck, oh, yeah. this one and he is neck. out cold. And oh, my like, gosh. Oh, weak ass nigga. 16, you want to do something? Yeah, that's right. Stay your big ass right there. So then here comes Vegeta. So it's like, all right, I see you got that perfect jawline and everything now. Ah. So you ready to scrap? Vegeta got some big ass ears. Uh, I Vegeta guess just be feels funny. So Vegeta oh. just starts throwing <laughs> everything. Bro, it's just his head is like huge. five four, bro. Like my mind his head is five four. Bro. Do a more He's five four. Yes, big Vegeta ass head, shorty. big ass ears. I think he's a five four, five six. Locking it. Bro's like my my prince are gonna have to do a little more than that to make me try now. So then Vegeta hits weak. him with this kick and he's like, yeah, yeah, I did that. So I was just looking at him like. Really? <laughs> Trash ass boy. So Vegeta's like, huh? What is this? And Cell's just laughing at him like, <laughs> Vegeta's so stupid, and you came up bro. With that corny ass oh, name called God. Super Vegeta. Now let me show you how to throw a kick. So he kicks Ooh, the oh. life out of this man. Look at him, he's flying through mountains. And then that he just sand pride that you fought up so for real, talking. He's like, wow, you was talking all that good shit a second ago. Now look at you. Is that a Team Four Star reference? Nah, that was Boondock. You know, Team Four Star said the same thing. They for real did? Yeah. Ain't no way! Come on! You were talking all that good shit a second ago! Then I blew your fucking lights off! So he kicks Ooh. the life out of this man! Look at him, he's flying through mountains! And then he just falls into the ocean. So Cell just starts talking, he's like, wow, you was talking all that good shit a second ago. Now look at your sorry ass. So then Vegeta <laughs> does personally my favorite attack in anime. He final Flash is your favorite? The final flash. Oh, and yes, Cell sir. is just standing there watching him do it. Bro's looking at him like, man, you're putting on a great light show, buddy. This rivals Disney World's fireworks show. So um, then Vegeta just starts calling to him. Sell you ass, fuck ass nigga. If you think you hot Bro, I wish I could uncensor right this so entire like, part what I, I said right there, bro. So then Vegeta gets him with the final. What is wrong with like, you? Oh my God. Oh. <laughs> I just had to censor because it was so many cuss words. It's back to back to back to back. Oh my gosh. Yo, you are hilarious. I was like, no way this is gonna slide. You know this is my nigga, right? Oh, uh, Kirito? Yeah. Hey, bro. Hot take. SAO is not that bad. I don't know why people hate on it so much. Y'all fucking it's heard not it that here bad. first. Y'all heard it I, here I first. Under, I understand the second arc. It was kind of weird, but Alcization is kind of fire. And yes. the first arc of SAO is some of the best shit. Like, change the fucking game, bro. Change the game, bro. Fucking love like, we, we can't like we can't hate on that, bro. I don't want to hear no more shit in my comments about SAO because y'all love talking about SAO. Fuck y'all. Y'all heard it here. <laughs> so everybody's I'm like, oh my weird. God, he's done it. Father's done it. So we Father's blew off it. half of Cell's chest. Father. Cell says, ugh, he actually hit me, damn it. So Vegeta's like, yes, <laughs> I did it. I am him. So while Vegeta <laughs> keeps on him. laughing, Cell says, stop my, laughing, my, my, my voice was hurting after that, bro. Like, for real, stop laughing. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that boy be straining his voice out for Oh real. my god, bro. It's just the look on his face that gets me every time. So it says, Did you forget that I had Piccolo cells as well, you dummy? So then Vegeta just losing it. He just starts spamming Keyblast. Well, when has that ever worked? When Vegeta Never. resorts to using the every time he spam does it, he, 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 he gets fucked over. up. So Cell I don't know why he does it. And just it. Oh God, so he bro. kicks him to high heaven and hits That's him with the That's his last minute resort right there. Oh, oh my God! Heaven. That edit right the there. Well, that that spike that's fire. edit right there. That's fire. That took an hour, bro. Really? This part took an hour. Hey, y'all heard it here first. CJ don't do no shortcuts when it comes to the vids, bro. No shortcuts, nigga. The winner is I went to college. What the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> Look, man, CJ has brought us another video, the most disrespectful moments in anime part six. Now, CJ, you are here with us today. Yes. What do you rate this video out of all your videos? Uh, I don't know. Uh, we, we just gonna have to find out. Uh, what y'all think, man?
Naruto Shippuden. Hi, ladies and gentlemen. Naruto, I always used to call it Naruto Hachi Shippuden. Little bro Shippuden. Ah, <laughs> yes, Shippuden. The time nigga. where we didn't know anything. The time that we thought that this man killed his entire clan for absolutely no reason at all. But Real anyways, nigga. as we know, Itachi and Kisame pulled up to the leaf. Oh, and God, they was bro. not was playing like, games. We, we didn't know what this man Itachi was. Naruto, we thought he was a straight Itachi demon. Oh, God, bro. He was stabbing this nigga. Well, I remember seeing this. I thought this nigga Itachi hours. was a demon. Bro, put this man oh, on God, the bro. stake. Absolutely torturing, And just kept bro. stabbing his... Like, wasn't this like three episodes long? Don't give up on me. No, no, it was it was a uh, seventy-two hours, bro. Damn, how many episodes did it go on for? Like it only went on for like in the episode, but like okay, he had that nigga in there for basically three days, just stabbing him. Damn, damn, just imagine getting stabbed for three days and you're ah. Uh. Seventy-one hours, fifty-nine minutes, and fifty-nine seconds left. And this man could cost you like. <laughs> Nah, bro, you telling me it's only been one second? Just getting stabbed oh for God. 72 so after hours. He finished torturing this man for basically three days in the water, Sukiyomi. Bro, pulls up on Naruto and he's like, Hey, what's good, little nigga? Go on and, uh. Was it true that he Sasuke? just wanted to see Sasuke? That's why you pulled up? That's right. I, for, I don't know. I drooling from the mouth. It can't what wait the to hell? You up and swallow Yo, Kisame, shut the f up! <laughs> Nigga Payne really partnered me with this zesty ass shark. <laughs> such a buzzkill, Itachi. Have some fun. So then Sasuke pulls up. And emo boy. Look at him. Look at his little emo ass. And this man Itachi emo like, ass boy, you well, know who it is. If it is my adolescent pain in the ass little brother. My kid brother. <laughs> like you're not that much of a bitch than the last time I saw you. God damn. Ass. That Sasuke bitch has some like. Rushes this man with a <laughs> but bro slaps his shit. To the side and grabs his hand and, and grabbed like, his hand. Wow. <laughs> Is this all you got, little nigga? I really Yo, like when I first saw the Sharingan, I thought that shit was so cold, bro. Like, I thought that shit was oh, the coolest God, thing bro. ever. Like, nigga, Itachi just had that shit on at all times. Like, he never turned that shit off. His that, hand. And he's like, <laughs> wow. That nigga was ready for <laughs> Is this all you got, little nigga? At all I times. I really left your sorry ass alive for this. So, bro, shatters ah. his voice. He looks at him and he says, I have no interest in you, little boy. So, bro, Damn. takes this man across the entire hallway. Oh, and he my got this gosh. Man slumped sitting in tornado drill position up against the wall. <laughs> but then Sasuke got up again and started talking. So, he started running at man. With a broken arm. Like, little boy, oh, God. Damn. 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 Oh my Naruto gosh. Was just watching it like, Yo, Naruto oh wasn't doing nothing. Even Jiraiya's like, Damn. <laughs> Could it be me? You're going to have to get six to jump me. Oh, yeah, yeah, you, yeah, 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 bro, hey, it really did have to, it really took six niggas to take that man down, though, bro, nah, you ain't lying, but come on, bro, that shit six hurt, six niggas to roll up on him, bro, <laughs> could it be me, you gonna have to get six niggas to jump me, then Itachi picks this man up and starts choking him on the ground, ah. and he says, oh, as weak as ever, I see, Looks like you still a little punk ass bitch. I love, love it. To it. The Remind bridge, me. the dubbing is fire. <laughs> oh, I think he makes him relive that moment, right? Oh my tripping. Yeah. Okay. He made him I'm... relive that entire moment. Hello? Bro. Hello. Everybody at? There better not be no damn prank. <laughs> Ew, the SpongeBob walk. Oh, what oh god. The <laughs> Oh, this music is fire! Where you get this from? Passed out right now. That's a uh, this Diavolo theme, bro. Okay, okay. Oh God, no, Auntie, Uncle, Auntie. Oh, oh <laughs> them niggas ain't breathing. Bro, a whole bridge with you would be fire. Damn. I wanna make one, bro. I just teleported to this big ass fucking door. <laughs> this big ass fucking door. Why am I shaking in my boots? Wait, wait. I don't even have my fucking shoes. <laughs> Hello? Mom? Dad? Ah! Oh, what do we have here? If Yo, the SpongeBob walk is so <laughs> nasty, bruh. Hey, hey bro, what the f going on? <laughs> Nigga, are you blind? <laughs> I obviously killed these niggas. <laughs> 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 
But why? Bro, they do be acting dumb as hell in anime. Like, exactly. nigga, do you not see what just happened? Not see what the <laughs> fuck I just did? Nigga, like, I just killed your whole fucking family, nigga. <laughs> oh, so little do you know, Sasuke. To save you the trouble, I'll start off with mother. Oh, gosh. Lazy, lousy bitch. <laughs> oh, oh, do the chores. <laughs> Holding laundry. Washing the dishes. Sasuke, do you know how fucking <laughs> old that shit gets? This nigga and tight. No allowance. <laughs> but, but brother, those are just chores. Shut up. Ah. Oh, no. And then father. What father do? What father do? Lazy clown of a bum. Just well, he likes the head ninja. Oh, my tripper. I caught him. I think he was. Mm. Red haired woman from the Uzumaki clan. Ah. To say the least, little brother, he was cheating. <gasps> oh. <laughs> Impossible. <laughs> no, Sasuke. Very possible. Now I shall make you watch them die for 24 hours. God damn, him and his time lapses, bruh. You smell that, Sasuke? That Uchiha pack is hitting. Um, rolling. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> just put that little nigga through the ringer. The ringer. The ringer. The ringer. Ew! <laughs> what is wrong with <laughs> you? Knew when I first started this series, this was yep. going to come eventually. But anyways, Sasuke and his new little rat. I'm replaying this shit into like, like the uh, PSP, PSP game, and I was like, "Who the fuck yeah. is this black nigga me. beating that the fuck, bro?" Just I just was like, "Who the fuck is this rapid ass nigga?" But I just think B was so goofy until he became a real nigga. Oh god, bro. Hey, boy. You the eight tails jinjuriki, right? <laughs> Not just eight tails, Lord eight tails. The fuck? The fuck? Y'all niggas doing on my goddamn <laughs> lawn, man. Simple. We're about to jump you. Oh, okay, okay, I get the situation. But before we do that, though, y'all heard that new white spice? This is warsome. That what? <laughs> <laughs> no! That's for you. That nigga, I'm hey, You don't shut the fuck what? up. Nobody ain't trying to hear that shit, man. Shut your hating ass up. You just mad because you ain't a munch. <laughs> Back yeah, back. hold on, hold on, bro. CJ, are, are you admitting to us that you're a munch, bro? I'm a munch, everybody. I'm a munch. <laughs> <laughs> he's a munch. He's a munch. Hey, bro, you don't bro shut Sasuke's the face is up. hilarious. Try to hear that oh, shit. Yeah. Man, shut your hating ass up. You just mad because you ain't a munch. God, <laughs> you ain't a back. munch. To shut the f out of this goofy ass nigga. Goofy. <laughs> Let me see. Through my telescope, I see <laughs> one, two, three, four. Four goofy ah niggas on my front. Yo, room. it's funny that he actually did that. Hey, bro, how about exactly. we just quit playing and jump this Dr. Seuss Horton his who rhyming ass nigga? You ain't gotta tell me twice, cut. So they just start jumping B and everybody's just getting molly whopped. Bro started twirling the sword oh, on shit. his neck. It was just Yo, that nigga was like crazy as hell. Uh, he, <laughs> <up in> <laughs> he was moving <laughs> him like a piece of trash. He proceeded to just start dissing him. So then oh, Sasuke he started rapping on them niggas. Up. Oh, he God, like, bro. All right, then. <laughs> Come on, run that fade then. So they start doing all this. Oh, bro. Hold on. I think in the anime, Kieran was like, get him, Sasuke. Get him. Or some shit. Oh, God. And this he got fucked up. He this nigga to get his ass beat, boy. She was just to get his ass beat. <laughs> he was like, "All right, then, <laughs> come on, run that fade, then." So they start doing all the spinning and stuff, and then they end up stopping. And this man B pulls out a whole ass notepad and starts writing in the middle of a fight. Um, that hey, is bro, wow. Oh, now that's disrespectful. Boy, I would have walked away. Like, I don't know about you, got it, bro. Yeah, like, oh God, bro. <laughs> <laughs> My bad, my boy. <laughs> I just had to write down this fire ass verse before I cook your ass. Bro, the dubbing is fire. <laughs> no. No, 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 no. Bro, no, stop bro. using this picture, this bro. Man took the time oh, to stop. The, the fucking this nigga. This nigga looks oh, like me. Ed? I don't like this. I do not like that seeing nigga, this. That's Bro, bro, that's me. Every time I see him, everybody says I look like him, bro. I don't like that. This man took the time to start writing down a whole verse mid fight. The straight up lack of bro. respect is appalling. Imagine you fighting and, good, and he say, "Oh my bad, bro. My mama calling. Can you hold real quick?" I'm saying, bro, bro I'm I'm walking away. I'm like, you got it, bro. Ass. 
He not taking me serious enough. That is exactly. wild. That's <laughs> disrespectful as hell. So then this man starts using nine sword style and just starts running Sasuke's pockets. Bro, he's yeah. up for his life. Even Sasuke Damn, like, bro. How, the thing is, how the fuck did he do that? So that bro started cold, tossing bro. him around. He was, bro. Counted his Chidori. Then it was like, uh, like a butterfly sting like a bee. My oh, dumb ass said flying so to then the Sasuke floor. gets bailed <laughs> out. I done fucked up the whole goddamn court. I'm so sorry, Muhammad Ali, man. May you rest in peace, my nigga. So then Sasuke gets bailed out for the first time in this fight. And I say first time because this man got bailed that out. That dog, multiple bro. Times what the fight. hell? <laughs> and he started munching on Karin. So then they oh, were like, God. All right, bro. There's only one way to beat this man. We just gonna have to jump him. So they started jumping him. And this man is still teeing off on him. Look at this Bro, his footwork is crazy. So oh, they God. finally ended up landing a hit, so he dipped off for a minute. Bro was like, hmm, so persistent, bum ass niggas, but we smoke that Zaza or just motherfucker that. What the? Hot, fuck? Hot, you, <laughs> you know what I'm saying right now, but hold on, bro. I gotta move myself real quick. What Yo. the fuck? Bro, y'all look at this shit, bro. This nigga is silly, bro. A hit, so he dipped off for a minute. Bro was like, hmm, so persistent, bum ass niggas, but we smoke that Zaza or just motherfucker that. Uchi hot pack be hit hard. He did the pack. He did the pack. You know right the now, pack. Bro, exactly. <laughs> What? That's how you know this fuck. is a nigga. Oh yeah, bro. Yeah, that, 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 that shit was fine. You can't hold me, nigga. I put that auto tune on that motherfucker. That nigga started singing. What the fuck? Watch, 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 me, watch me. Watch me hit that. Know what I'm that saying right now, but be flat, nigga. So, bro, go. Hey y'all, uh, you're hilarious, man. So bro goes eight tails, blasts these damn off of the mountain. Sasuke tries to hit him with a genjutsu, but bro bypasses it and gives this man the nastiest. Yeah. Oh like, my god! Is gone, shattered, eviscerated. That means nah, nah, jaw this bro is broken. Been dead. And they yeah, he should have. His neck should have been broke. His pockets ran. Where the. F it's the plot armor, nigga. So then Where the B fuck goes is the into plot armor, nigga? On eight tails mode. Oh yeah, it's he over. He's fighting Sue gets to win this big ass kaiju battle. So bro's like, who the f do you think you is, Aquaman, nigga? I <laughs> Wait, what's about to happen? Oh, that's not that bad. This nigga, for yo, yo, bro. This <laughs> 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 Hey, bro, what this was nigga that? put a yeet song in there. Be hit him with that yeet oh, bell. Yeah. Oh my god, bro. <laughs> that yeet bell, hey, that yeet bell do be hitting. That, that yeet bell, hit. that yeet bell do be hard <laughs> as hell, though. You can't count. Literally turned this man into nuts. What is that? Uh, oh my god. Look at him. Even so, nah, he do like, like mm. oh my god, bro. <laughs> he was he ran off for real. Him. But I mean, we all know how this fight ended. That plot armor kicked in for Sasuke. And he oh, yeah, he started burning, burning his ass. Russell, yeah. But come oh, God. <laughs> we all know, bro, this man got whooped. If he got whooped. His he got his ass beat. There, his ass would have been grass. Because the fact that this man took the time out of his day to write some bars down right Yo, in front I of your face. Yo, I'm trying to tell you, that's crazy. To whoop your ass? Nah, bro, you should have been six feet under. Nah, he got he got caught on that one, bro. Man got bailed out. All bro. right, uh, Sasuke. Next up on the mm -mm -mm. Hey, so, no cap though. Sasuke and Vegeta what looking kind of similar right now. Sasuke and Vegeta began no. their ass beat the fuck up. No cap, and they both got the same like you know that little like secondary yeah, protagonist. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Those pockets. Well, I mean, since uh, Bleach is back, why not put some Bleach in here? But of course. First of all, we have to acknowledge the fact that this man, Grimjow, is a absolute smoke demon. I mean, you can he tell is. this is a crazy ass nigga just by his last name. Jagger Jack? I can't That's his name? That shit. That's how yes, you know bro. he a Grim demon. Jow, Jack, this is a horrible name. Like those most notorious <laughs> uh, and <laughs> and <laughs> Grim Jow Jagger Jack. Yeah, I ain't. I, I, like, I, <laughs> I imagine being in school and somebody was named that. Hey, bro, you know Grim Jow Jagger Jack? What the fuck is that? What the fuck I is that? that nah, bro. I nah, bro. <laughs> he a demon. But anyways, Waco Mundo's most notorious op ended up pulling up on Ichigo and Rukia. And dog wasn't wasting no time. Bro was like, all right, listen up. Uh, which one of y'all the strongest? Like, straight up. Like, don't waste my time. So Damn. Bro, straight, straight into it. This is Rukia in the uh. stomach. Ooh, nigga, nigga, what, looking like on timing, bro. Hurt. And Grimjaw like, oh, just like that. It's your weak ass. Go ahead and uh, move to the side for me, will you? Oh so my god! Ichigo gosh. tried to attack him, but bro stopped it with his wrist. And bro's like, bro, if you don't get this fat ass butter knife <laughs> off me, hey, bro, for real though, uh, when you gonna what use the Bankai? Huh? Like for real, bro. Come on now, transform. You bullshit. You wasting time. 
Now come on now, chop chop. Damn, chop, he wants you at full ass, power. Bitch over there. So they started to get the scrapping, and this man Ichigo looked like he could just not keep up at all. Bro grabbed his sword mid swing and looked at him like, really? Is this your oh Bakai my god, man, this nigga grim y'all on timing. Bro was for real fucking like a rag doll. Then he read this man's movement like a book, grabbed his sword mid swing. Oh my again, gosh. Then he kicked the life out of bro. Damn. 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 Grab that shit with his bare hand. And he bro. said man's flying, doing backflips. <laughs> made him run a red light. Then man's blessed him <laughs> and kicked the soul out of him. And Ichigo looking like, damn. <laughs> Maybe this soul rip of life ain't for me. That nigga start rethinking his whole life, bro. <laughs> oh, God, bro. But no, no. You see, it just got worse from here. Grimjow started walking him down. This nigga put this sail up and started laying the hands on him. Damn, like, damn, yo, damn, 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 damn. He back and started playing this sad ass music in the background. And each He's still going. His life. Oh, God. He's still going. Bro, got slapped by another nigga. This nigga having a whole flashback. <laughs> I'm just not him right now. <laughs> that nigga's not a main character no more, Brody. God dog, boy, that all you got? That nigga turned that into a side you character you real quick. Cause that was a little too easy. Look at boy. that, see? Hey boy, time to go home. Oh shit. Toast. Damn, what What's is your blonde black ass doing here? Damn. Hey boy, Ozzy mad. I ain't gonna hold you, cuz. We gotta get back to base pronto. This, this music cut on, this shit kind of cool. I leave, dog, God. Hey, boy, you best remember my name, the Waco Mundo Demon. You best come back and get it back in blood, or else you a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, uh, next up on the program. Yo, this picture. Bitch rocking Vidal's That's world. the dopest picture. Yeah, I, I'm bringing this one out, bro. Like go I said ahead, earlier bro, with ahead. the B one, this was just inevitable. Ladies and gentlemen, the most brutal beatdown in anime history. So the most we brutal? Know, it's the World Martial Arts yes, Tournament, nigga. and Videl yes. has to fight. Yes. This shit went on for two episodes. Yes. Really? Yeah. Something yes. was wrong with this shit this from shit the jump. Terrible. I mean, look at this nigga. Motherfucker look this like a buff is... ass crackhead with an M tattooed on his head. Look like a buff ass egg. Videl was teeing off oh, on me. It looked like easy money at the beginning. But something was terribly wrong. Bro <laughs> was not going down at all. I think all. he gets and stronger every Goku time he attacks, right? The first people to notice something was wrong. Yeah, because he just don't go down. Like, okay. Yo, you seeing this shit right now? Yeah. Hey, that M tattoo on his forehead look kind of bad. <laughs> I think I'll go for So, of course, this man ah. Gohan was oblivious. I was like, yeah, that's my girl, y'all. <laughs> look at this little you simp ass. This but then oh, Goku God. said, yo, she should quit right now. Wait, Dad, what you mean? You know when yeah, Goku, Goku gets serious, Goku shit that. is real. Shut the fuck up. Some shit going Talk on. Oh, God. Right now. Gohan, tell your girl to quit right now, or you gonna regret it, my boy. Look at her. She's getting her shit. <laughs> Damn. Hey, girl, you best get the f up. I ain't letting no pussy <laughs> ass bitch man, my son. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> tell her, Chi-Chi. <laughs> so then Videl starts flying right. So then Gohan started to get happy again, but then this man Goku said, Stupid idiot. She <laughs> ring. Damn, oh, bro, you've been Yo, when Goku is serious, it's scary. Yep, and guess it's what? Just, oh, God, bitch. bro. Father knows best. I mean, look at him, Gohan. He doesn't even look sane. So then Videl kicked this man's head so far. His head was 180. But then, bro, got back up. Yeah, see, this is what. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Nope, nope, nope. Yeah, this is when you get the fuck out of the oh, ring. My yeah, ass would have ran out. the fuck out. out. Nigga, you switched your out, head bro. backwards? All right, you got. Nah, thank you. Nah, nah, nah. This one, she should have left, bro. <laughs> She should have loved right after that. I, I forfeit. <laughs> I, I quit. White flag. I'm sorry. I forfeit. He, nah, that's some scary Bro shit. got back up and fixed his head. Nah, nope, that ain't nope, it. Nope, nope. This is when you should have quit. Because God yep. dog, bro. He ain't lying. This is when it just went from zero to 100. This man's Popovich started whooping. He started to hit it with the combos. Hit, put, damn, put, damn, put, damn, put, damn. Damn. Oh, my he gosh. I'm about to get in the ring and help this bitch. <laughs> Damn, he didn't even let her get out the ring. Oh, uh, uh, this is stupid. Bro, picked her up again and said, hey. "Oh my God!" Yeah, she is not having kids. No more. Everybody like, oh, hey, God. yo, just stop. I, I, I don't know right. how Pan got born. Yeah, yeah this is insane. Oh my! G G G G G. Game over, nigga. Then this Damn. man Gohan just started getting mad, bro. Well, what you gonna like, do, Gohan? I, I, don't do it. I told you to tell her to quit. But you didn't want to <laughs> listen to me. Now you yeah, gonna do it, bro? This oh God, bro. is terrible. Bro started stomping on her. Oh ass. my God, it's still the going on. Yamu came in. <laughs> exactly, hey, bro. Me. Quit playing with a little stupid ass and uh, just go ahead and kick her off the ring. Oh man. 
Oh, I was hoping. Thank you, baby Jesus. Uh -huh. Then Gohan came out, and this man, Spopa Bitch, looked at him like, <laughs> How does it feel that your girl got her back blown out by me before you? Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. <laughs> uh, All righty, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, uh, next up, uh, I am a Koji body in class C. So this man, Ryun, right? He got old girl up in. What anime is this? Classroom with the Elite. Oh, damn. You ain't watching nah. it? Nah. See, I'm about to learn something right here. So this man, Ryun, right? He got old girl up in here getting tortured. Bro, pouring this cold ass what? water on her in this Oh, wait. Room. I be seeing this on the bad ass moments, I think. And he yes. Oh, wait. This the, when the nigga comes in and beat all they ass. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Bet. So bro pulls up outside of the place in this big ass nigga god <laughs> damn what the fuck is they feeding you what are you doing at some random high school in japan you need to take your ass and i don't know where you want to go to nba or the nfl <laughs> you can choose my nigga. you want to play linebacker or you want to play power forward and his name is <laughs> albert albert no, no no don't make me do it bro do it bro <laughs> hey 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 oh my <laughs> i thought it was a good about to start spitting Wait a Ow. damn minute. Ow. Ain't no way in hell you the mastermind. This shit, I say that you can speak while you wouldn't miss in my presence. Damn. Uh, no, no. That's right with all that jibber jabber shit. Shut the f up. Oh my so gosh. Text message that one of my tools from my toolbox has gone. Hey nigga, come get your bitch. <laughs> <laughs> tool. Yes, tool. The f you know, goodness and will, I've been using her since day one. I literally set her up to get jumped. Watch her, oh. her ass beat. Then blackmailed her right after it. Wait, did he do all that for real? Devious. Yes. That's fucked I up. Know, Cause I'm a devious ass. Exactly. Man. All right, bro. You may be devious, but uh, you about to get jumped. <laughs> jumped? No. You see, you got it all wrong. Because this is a cold. I seen. I already know what's about to happen. He about to fuck these all niggas up. Fuck these niggas no up, bro. Please don't jump my baby. Don't get your ass up. <laughs> Please don't jump <laughs> okay, my baby. I like you, boy. Hey, sick him and take his turn. <laughs> Nothing personal, but I'm about to run your pocket. <laughs> Jesus, help me. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Come on, hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Albert, you best with that nigga ass, you D1 prospect. I'm fucking weak. <laughs> oh, my oh, gosh. Oh, sweet Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> do that. Oh, do that. <laughs> yeah. Not bad. He just beat Albert, a D1 prospect going to Alabama to play linebacker. Them niggas do be over explaining, niggas. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> <laughs> I know Caprera. I mean, it is. Definitely. Hey, nah, it's fine. It's, just it's fine. In you, fuck, nigga. <laughs> yeah, yeah, coming from my face. Oh, my gosh. Is this is Tekken? Hey, this is oh, funny, bro. Come on, bro. Don't tell me they hyped you up all this time just to be trash. <laughs> Bitch ass nigga, stop playing with my name! <laughs> yeah, yeah. Hey, like hey he got a little hit in. We about to get fucked up, though. With your hot ass breath. Get your unhygienic uh, ass off. Ah, uh, damn, damn, damn. Damn, bro. I just got fucked up. Uh, with the wrong nigga. So, yeah, this man reunion just got humbled real quick. Bro took top mountain and just started beating him. But while bro was getting the he's still down, going. He just started rambling going, about bro. Like, just feelings and stuff. Bro was like, what? how do you feel, huh? How do you feel? And this man, I and Akoji looking at him like, uh, I don't feel nothing. Me, but uh, the fuck are you talking about? Why should I show any emotion to get some weak ass trash like you? Just go ah. ahead and just shut your mouth. Damn. Yeah. Hey, that nigga a demon, bro. I gotta watch that anime. I ain't gonna lie. Oh, God, nah, bro. This I is 45, bro. So out of this. Bet. How many episodes? Beat him physically and mentally. Uh, Look at him after the bet. fight. Bro, looking like a Debbie Downer. All his spirit is just gone. Bro, got his ass <laughs> beat so bad. Bro, look at He lost his soul in his eyes. That nigga, oh, God, that nigga bland as fuck now. Look at him. <laughs> look at him, bro. <laughs> he lost all that spunk. A fight. Bro, looking Man, like I'll, a Debbie I'll Downer. Lost it all, all his spirit bro. is just gone. Bro, got his ass beat so bad, he was about to drop out. And then you got a girl right <laughs> here like... What you, the wizard man I used to know. That man gone, shorty. Nah, he is gone. That nigga lost all his fighting <laughs> spirit. Damn, now he getting yeah. beat up by. <laughs> now he getting beat up by henchmen. This nigga just. <laughs> this nigga changed his whole life after that, bro. Oh, that God, ass whooping bro. really changed him. Changed his life. Oh, this. Damn, oh. This little Martinez motherfucker is out of control, and he needs to be put down now. I actually like this anime. I know. 
That's oh, this anime was fire, bro. Him. Who is him? Jerome, you know exactly who I'm talking Adam about. Adam Smasher. Oh, 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 God, ma'am. Oh, hell no. <laughs> yes, that's right, Jerome. Him. And we don't even have to call him because he's already here. Yo, I, when I seen that nigga just sitting there, I bro, was like, what the was fuck? Okay. That, <laughs> nigga, was like, that nigga was sitting in the corner, bro. I was like, I was like oh, fuck this shit. I was like, yeah, they're done, bro. They're done. <laughs> I said, I thought this nigga was a myth. I thought he was a myth. I thought he was a myth. No. No, bro. <laughs> right, Jerome. I was like, they're him. done. And we don't even have to call him because he's already here. And he's just sitting there hey, menacingly. Hey, what the fuck? Oh, hell no. Hey, yo, when did this big ass Decepticon ass get in here? <laughs> oh, Jerome. He's been here the whole time. He's just so powerful. You can't even sense his presence. I'm what? freaking that, weak. That, that makes no sense. <laughs> Jerome, can you process anything with all that chrome in your fucking dome? This is an anime, nigga. Crown Nothing dome. makes sense. Capiche? Adam, get your ass up. Time to go to work, you full metal, nigga. Take Jerome with you. Time to go smash some niggas. I'm not an alchemist, bitch. So just call me full nigga. Full, full metal, metal nigga. nigga. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> full, full metal, metal nigga. nigga. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, why did I sign up for this job? Stand back, Jerome. You! Yo, did you make uh, that you voice? See, my evil yeah. voice. Fuck. Shut your mouth, Damn. ugly. Adam uh, uh, Smasher, please help me. Excuse me, but who the f*** are you? <laughs> Yo, when he did that, I oh said ego. Yeah, you better shut the f*** up before I put a motherfucking bullet in your mouth. He did not give a fuck please about that nigga, bro. Oh, ah, ah, ah. So you're the full metal nigga. <laughs> Damn right, boy. And you're a nobody. Do you want to know why you're the main character of a prequel? Simply ah. Because you don't make it to the actual game. Damn. Damn. That's bullshit. <laughs> hey, that that is disrespectful. Bro, he wasted no time, bro. Exactly, bro. Like all that talking oh, shit. So fine. When we get hey, Lucy was I'm bad as fuck. Welcome back here, Romeo and Juliet. <laughs> <laughs> sons of bitches. Shakespeare made you a pack and so <laughs> <laughs> Yo, what do you come up with this shit? Oh no, bro. Shakespeare <laughs> made you a pack and, and so will I. For your dumb ass. Oh, oh man. <sighs> Foolish girl, trying to challenge me. You see, here's what I'm going to do to you. I am about to keep back the shit out of you. Extract my metal. Chrome nuts across your fucking forehead. Nothing. Oh my else. God. But I have a reputation and a name that I have to keep in good standing. Adam, smash her. Uh huh. Hey, that nigga is stupid, bro. You're silly, bro. <laughs> Adam, smash her. <laughs> yeah, bro. You got it. Right there. Martinez. And it's not even over yet, y'all. Exactly. Don't you want to end up like your little girly friend? Smashed your man to a piece of meat. <laughs> Can't even show the body or else I'll probably get a guy like strike. You can't kill some people. Yeah. I thought, I ain't gonna lie, I thought plot armor was gonna take over. Wait, you have a uh -uh, bro. Stand? They did not care. You think you're special or something? They did not. I told you, you're just a prequel character. Damn. Look at you on the ground. Now Look at this nigga season out. Oh, hell no. Uh, <laughs> are you trying to hack me, bitch? <laughs> I have two step authentication. Fuck off of my son. <laughs> 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 oh, shit. Yo, that one caught me off guard. <laughs> 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 oh, shit. I'm about to cry. Yo. Hack me, bitch. Mm. I have two-step authentication. Fuck off of my server. Oh, God. oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Where the hell do you think you're going, pussy nigga? <laughs> Get the fuck off of my screen. <laughs> Eat my middle dick. <laughs> Look at you. You're just scrap. I told you you wouldn't make the main game. Damn, bro. Right. Right. Just be remembered as a drink in the barn that nobody goes to. Oh. 
at least my jack is a DLC. Lucky anybody's gonna wear that shit. Oh. <laughs> Damn. Oh my gosh. That's a cool ass edit. That was fire. That was fire. And just like that. Ah! More anime disrespectful moments. Let's get to it. Yo, where's my homie at? Oh yeah, your home dog that look like Brock. Yeah, young blood. I got you. He right here. Oh, oh my god. Ah! He waiting for you in the gulag right now. <laughs> what are you doing? I want to make a deal for the OnlyFans. Hey, come back. <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with CJ? <laughs> First up is a actual three in one. So oh. uh, the Tempest Federation violating the church. Now a lot happened during this war, but the amount of disrespect dished out by these three specifically is just is is absolutely Rimuru? disgusting. So they ended up pulling up on these fatherless bastards. Cause they oh. came back to get it back in blood after they ran up on their village the first time. And these dudes deserved every last bit of the violation that got served to them. Like you really thought you was going to Ben Rimuru's block and walk away from that bitch unscathed? <laughs> nah, nigga, you signed your death papers and you are a fucking opposition, a dead one at that. So we saw uh. with this Brock looking motherfucker talking shit to Hakuro. And see, here's the thing, bro walked into his own death. You wanna know why he walked into his why? own death? Simple, you should know to not f with old, old niggas, niggas in, in anime. anime. Like my boy, you are from our world. How do you not know this? You should know that the old heads are always cracked. And then you see they him are. standing like and this. He's, he's standing there menacingly, smiling with no care in the world. Hi, how are you? Look at his little face, his face. You should know that the old heads are always cracked. And then you see him standing like this, looking like, oh, why hello there, sunny, wonderful weather we're having today, isn't it? Nigga, <laughs> you gon' die. So then Unk start looking at him like, you know, Serious. sunny, I really can't stand you and your new generation. You oh. see, back in my day, we didn't have pussies like y'all. All oh. y'all do is stay inside and scroll on that sell your device. What is that y'all be on? Oh, it's caught TikTok, you fucking boomer. Why the fuck did he show this? Uh, you kids are gonna- Oh, that shit got hard. All right, all right, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Uh, you kids are gonna make me dive cringe before Father Time catches up to me. So he starts fighting Hawk Girl and he takes this little nigga to school. Hawk started blocking all of his attacks. Oh. He hasn't even moved from the he same didn't spot move. he started in. And he looking at him like, well, come on, sonny boy. You was talking all that shit. And all those blades. You dumbass. You're baffled, aren't you? You dumb I'm baffled. <laughs> Fuck you, you prehistoric boomer! So then Kyoto starts blitzing him with his all-seeing eye. And this is where this idiot shot himself in the foot. So Hunk started weaving all of his attacks. And then he looked at his dumb ass and said, Oh, you think you're fast, youngin? My eyes have already caught up to yours, boy. Now let me show you speed. Water breathing form 69. Chris Water Slash! Hey, is that a water breathing technique for real? Or did he just say that? Fatality, Unk wins. This man just sliced a bro's head clean <laughs> off, grabbed his head and said, uh, now see, look, your youngsters move too fast. You want to use all that acceleration bullshit and look where I got you, headless. <laughs> your ugly ass probably never even got head yourself. What a oh. sad life. Now use all this extended time you gave yourself to think about your actions. <laughs> So after the first fatherless idiot has been taken care of, we cut over to the second one. So this oh man Shogo fighting big homie Geld. So the obviously Shogo talking shit like the fatherless bastard he is. Golly. Did he know he was about to get adopted. Cause this man Geld was about to sun his ass. So bro started hitting him with that rock. So then he started screaming and saying, uh, fuck you, you nigga was tooted up. Pig. Really? Pig? I'm a orc, you racist ass bastard. See, I must be racist too. I swear that was a big ass pig. Fucking pig! Really? Pig? I'm a orc, you racist ass bastard. You know what? I should chop your balls off. Wait, ah, wait, wait. Hold ah. on. Hey, call me. I'll give, you, I'll give you all my money. You know what? I'll give you my Sarah J OnlyFans. The subscription's worth $50. Gail, you ain't disposed of this sorry ass nigga yet. Hey, my bad, OG. Wait, can you say that? Chop his balls off. So then Shogo ask, yo, where's my homie I at? Oh who yeah, your home dog that look like Brock. Yeah, young blood, I got you, he right here. Oh my God. <laughs> 
He waiting for you in the gulag right now. <laughs> hey, old nigga, where you going? I want to make a deal for the OnlyFans. Hey, come back. A few <laughs> moments later. The orc thing makes sense it. now. Um, excuse me, nigga. I have a name. You see? All right, everybody's just saying nigga at this point. I don't think they have the rights to be saying these words. Hey, yo, bro, where you at? Um, excuse me, nigga. I have a name. You see, this is why you and your nigga don't get no head. I, 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 shut up. Nobody cares. Listen. <laughs> give me <laughs> Huh? What did he say? Hey. Oh, Shut up, nobody cares. Listen, give me that ass. Huh? <laughs> so while this man is choking out the girl to take her powers, Gelden Hawkgirl standing outside the tent like- Is that how that works? Mm -hmm. Who let him cook? I don't know, <laughs> Punk, but I'll tell you this, he ain't cooking shit. So this man Shogo <laughs> come out the tent, bro got Kuraga now, and he like, yeah! Kingdom Hearts <laughs> reference. Yeah! <laughs> you ain't cooking shit. Shut up, you fat ass pig, before I turn you into bacon, nigga. So this man Gelder is sick of it at this point. The bro starts walking to him and says, Before Bruh. I kill you, I will give you the. What's funny is CJ is literally like this in person. That nigga is, he just be saying the most craziest shit out of his mouth. And Geld is sick of it at this point. The bro starts walking to him and says, Before I kill you, I will give you the pleasure of learning my name. I am Geld. But the orc holes in the village love to call me Tyrone. And that is what you will be calling me after I pound you into a pile of shit and add you to my roster, bitch. <laughs> oh Shut up, my god. Get ready to become a ham and cheese. And get ready to become my son. Ah! Where do you think you're going, whole ass nigga? So this man Gil just starts pummeling him into the ground. So then he tells him, oh well, look at here. Looks like you turned yourself into an immortal punching bag. Congratulations, you played yourself. Now oh, you can never die now? Till your MP runs. Oh, oh. Shut the fuck up, low ass nigga. Bitch ass, pussy ass, punk ass nigga. I'll beat the door. This is a God of War music dumbass. too? Captain hey, looking that's like a crazy. He <laughs> probably smashing. He probably smashing. I ain't gonna lie, this nigga got fucked up. I can see why this has a Kratos music. <laughs> Tell me, boy, what's my name? <laughs> Tyrone! I can hear that! What's my name, nigga? <laughs> Tyrone! That's what I thought. Now, hey. <laughs> what's my name, nigga? Tyrone! That's what I thought. <laughs> Now hand over Sarah J's OnlyFans. <gasps> then you can go join your homie in the gulag. Oh my gosh. Okay, here you go, here you go. Excellent. I wish you luck in the gulag. <laughs> this man is war some. This is the gulag. In here, you fight to win back your life. What the fuck? <laughs> no, you see, what you just witnessed was an alternate universe. Because bro got bailed out by this level 99,000 ass wizard. But I mean, bro still did take a trip back to the lobby because a level 99,000 wizard took his body. But you want to know who Wait, didn't what? get bailed out? Everybody else. This is Garimaru went on a fire sale. Bro boosted his KD so hard when he killed this whole damn army. Nigga stood over everybody, lined up each shot precisely, and hit him with the. <laughs> Kill, kill, atrocity, kill him, Jaro. Oh Lord, what the hell is happening? Lord Farquaad the Fifth, please calm down, sir. Yes, me lord. With my unique skill, Spearhead, you should be able to escape the enemy and not get head tapped. Oh yes, excellent, excellent. Give me the fuck out of here, please. Right away, sir. <laughs> oh Lord, we <laughs> swapping up the day long. So after Rimuru. How, how strong is Rimuru? Because people be saying he could be Goku, but I be thinking they capping. I be thinking they capping, bro. So after Rimuru finishes head tapping everybody, he comes down and rises and starts trying to talk and starts saying, Now you stop right there, you dirty, filthy monster. I shall let you know that the nation of Falmuth and our king, the great Lord Farquaad V, do not negotiate with terrorists. Yeah, because <laughs> I didn't come here to negotiate shit. Lord, please hear us out. Please, please, negotiations. Oh my yes, gosh. yes, please don't shoot. Fine, I won't shoot. 
Yes, you see, uh, would you like to become a territory? I mean, you're sure gonna have to pay taxes and shit, but uh, that's better than being in Taxes? Right? Taxes? <laughs> I don't do W-2s, fucker. Wait. Yeah, we don't. Tonight, nah. We, we have TurboTax to help you. I'll, I'll even let you get away with tax evasion. This Yo, nigga said TurboTax. Yeah, nigga, I lied. And that's against the law. <laughs> you fucking fed. So after this, Rimuru decide to take everybody else's soul. So he gonna get enough to become a demon lord. But after that, bro started wobbling. Nigga look like he just got straight off the henny. So then he ends up summoning this broken <laughs> what ass Diablo. Cause bro is somehow still alive. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. The time I got reincarnated as a slime is actually really good. This shit's on fire. What the fuck? Started wobbling. Nigga look like he just got straight off the henny. So then he ends up summoning this broken ass the Diablo. Cause bro is somehow still alive. And dear God, what he did to this man was just an absolute violation. Bro sent a fireball at him. He blew it away. Man summoned a golem. We backhanded that bitch. Oh my God. To finish him off. He hits this man with this I mean ass light skin snare. He took his soul. He took his soul. He Yo. killed him by staring at him. He that sexy. <laughs> he that sexy. Alrighty. Uh, next up is this big ass Tyrone ass nigga just being a bully. I mean, uh. first of all, look at this man's name, Charon. Charon, nigga, that looks like and sounds like Tyrone to me. <laughs> I mean, look at this big ass nigga pull up behind them. Absolutely asserting dominance over the situation. On oh, fire like, force. Hey, how y'all doing? I'm looking for a mentally unstable woman with pink hair. Is that you by any chance? Uh, maybe. Hey, man, what do you think you're doing, bro? How about you? Now, why the fuck would you touch this big black man? You're white. Nah, I'm playing, I'm playing, I'm playing. Just jokes. No, it's not. Maybe. Hey, man, what do you think you're doing, bro? Hold How on. I this nigga figures about big as shit. Y'all see these big ass fingers? What the fuck? Who animated this? Totally unstable woman with pink hair. Is that you by any chance? Uh, maybe. Hey, man, what do you think you're doing, bro? How about you just go fuck? Oh, my God. <laughs> Dirty ass nigga touch my goddamn all white geek. Nigga, the fuck? Lame ass nigga. So he starts chasing down Inka and trying to catch her. But then Shinra comes in and hits him with the knee. And bro ain't even move. And then he gets up with all this confidence and starts saying, Hi, my name's Captain Saverho, Shinra Kusakabe at your service. <laughs> nigga, what is going through your mind? You just need a nigga at full speed and he didn't move? Bro, I'd be worried about my safety and her safety at that point. I mean, she already a lost cause. She batshit crazy. Like, my guy, she don't want to be saved. So, my boy, you don't save this her. whooping yourself. So then this man, Charon, said, All right, gang, you want to scrap then? Let's scrap then. Squad, hype me up. B Shinra kicks him in the face. This nigga did not just say that. B -B -L 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 -L. Well, then this man Shinra kicks him in the face, but he ate it and said, oh, so of we course. just gonna kick a nigga in the face during Black History Month. All right, then, nigga. <laughs> the lame ass. And then he starts dragging him. Oh, my God, Shinra, bro. This is why we do not try to be Captain save a ho. Look at the situation you're in. You are fighting a nigga so strong, the ground is exploding when you're going to give up. I'm going to give up. Y'all going to be saying, but CJ, he's supposed to be a hero. That's against his morals. Nigga, fuck your morals. <laughs> hey, hey, but people should have said right here, though. <laughs> ain't no way. <laughs> no fucking way. Black History Month too, <laughs> yo. <laughs> Man, Frieza would be so proud right now. They what? both start talking about how they gonna take Inka back with them. But she ends up saying, nah, f both of y'all niggas. So he walks over to her and says, hey, little girl, you better shut the f up before I slap shit out your little stupid <laughs> ass, you heard? Shut your dumb ass up. Hell no. So later on, why wait, they keep- Wait, she get horny off that? Hey, little girl, you better shut the f up before I slap shit out your little stupid ass, you heard? 
Girl, Why does he start smiling? Later on, while they keep on fighting, Shinra starts flying away to go find Inca again. But then this man looking at him like, the fuck? <laughs> Where you think you going, Captain Save a Ho? You know what? <laughs> Let me bring your bitch ass back down to Earth. So this man jumps into the stratosphere, grabs Bruh, and starts slamming him through buildings. God, I hope these people have home insurance. But don't start <laughs> flipping himself, but look at him. This landed and hit the that spike. Oh, it's nice. He's just, just nice. Corona. I even just... forgot to mention this motherfucker's blindfolded. No, no. <laughs> no, we saw quick. it. So they about to capture her. So he's like, hey, stop right there. She looked at him like this and was saying sh like, fuck off. I don't need your saving ho ass nigga. I live for the streets. I die for the streets. I love the chaos. So stop worrying about me and go get a dental appointment with them fuck ass teeth. Oh, oh. <laughs> this nigga is crazy. So they started scrapping again. So Shinra kicked him. He ate the kick. Chopped this oh. nigga. Then bro said, Clap! Bro, just give up, Shinra. Give up. Give up. Oh give up. God, somebody it's okay to give up. No, no, it's no, no, no. okay this to give up. Crazy. He has his squad jump him. And the gang initiation is this. Then he charges up a Kamehameha and fries this nigga point blank. God, look at him, bro. It's like a Game over. piece of charcoal. The soul has left his body. But with the <laughs> power of plot armor, bro somehow got up. So Shiver got in his zone, got his hands right, and said, Fresh up, man. So he is CJ is the funniest nigga ever. Something is wrong with this nigga. This nigga is so stupid, bro. So Shiver got in his zone, got his hands right, and said, Fresh up, man. So he ends up hitting a final smash on that nigga. Bro has left the stage. So they gotta be thinking, oh, this fight's over. Bro's nah, nah, knocked nah, out, nah. right? Nah, yeah, uh, nah, nah. no. He a tank. He a tank. And sucks the shit out of this nigga. Oh my god. Shinra. Bro hit him with a Give rage up. art. Look at his body. It's <laughs> in the wall. <laughs> hey, but I mean, he got up again just to get told off by Crazy Shawty, then slap in the face once more. So while she walking off with the Evangelist, this man Shinra is so mad. Bro, I'll beat up his shit in the corner. Then he started yelling at her like, fuck, I'm gonna kill you, stupid bitch. <laughs> Oh my God, you do not know how happy that just made me. What you just said made me so warm and hot inside. <laughs> Please try your best. What the fuck? Why are you her? Just let a nigga smash. That bitch is crazy. Basically, Shimmer got fucked up for no reason. That, that's basically what happened. Shimmer got fucked up for no reason. I ain't touched this anime in a minute, but Luffy smacking the shit out of Bellamy. Ah, man. Oh, this finally is one some of little One Piece sprinkle. Ass whoopings that was done with absolute. Cause y'all want no Doflamingo. Effort. So the straw has pulled up in Jaya, and they end up running into the Bellamy Pirates, being some damn dickheads. Look at this motherfucker. Bro looked at Luffy and said, boy, if you don't get your dirty ass out of my face, here, take some money, nigga. Get your drip up, nigga. Trash ass with them worn out jeans and them busted ass sandals. Wait, hold on, you ain't lying? You get your ass over here. Yes, ma'am. So I would take the money too. At the bar, and they meet Bellamy. So bro walk up in there like, oh, so you're the guy worth 30 million. Who the fuck's this guy? I don't know, but he looks like a minority. So bro offers what? Luffy a drink, but he slams his face into the counter. So then he ends up just starting to beat him. The whole bar start throwing shit, and then they just started jumping him. But the thing is, they wasn't doing nothing because they ain't give a fuck. They ain't give a fuck about the nigga till they ran up and stole the gold that they needed. So then later that night, this dude runs up in the bar and Wait, he's what? saying, Bail me! You need to get the fuck out of here now! Man, what are you talking about with your ugly ass? Them two dudes that you beat up, them dudes is Timothy! Look! <laughs> so then all these dudes end up realizing, dude's bounty ain't no 30 mil, they ain't get the new patch notes. Bro, shit was 100 mil, them niggas was speechless. Then bro saying, b -b -b Bail me! You best get the stamping. You best hope he doesn't come get his get back. Man, get yeah, his get back. Honey mail my ass. <laughs> they is pussy. You know what? <laughs> You're right. We shouldn't be scared of nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Why does nigga do the fucking SpongeBob laugh, bro? Get the fuck. You're right. We shouldn't be scared of nothing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the SpongeBob music in the back. <laughs> I tried to warn you, Melby. 
Man, shut your bitch ass up. So this man Bellamy walk outside and he see Luffy standing on top of this tower looking like he Batman or something. So then bro, <laughs> is this goofy ah devil fruit, bro. I cannot stand this fucking fruit at all, dog. Bro look like Slinky Dog with this shit. So Bellamy's like, yeah, so you came to get your get back. Nah, I mean, not for real. I just need to go and I don't give a fuck about your dumb ass. So they start fighting and this man Bellamy looks like he's actually him with this Slinky Dog machillin' man ass fruit. So this man Luffy <laughs> falls all the way down. Why this man Bellamy talking shit and his whole crew in the background talking like, yeah, that's right, finish his trash ass. Yeah, that's right, bum ass nigga. So then this man Bellamy uses spring hopper, hopping around like an uncontrollable idiot. Bro looking like a kid who OD'd on Flintstone gummies. And Luffy just Shut standing the there like, <laughs> sick of this shit. So all bros hopping around, bro asked him, God, 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 God. do you even know how to throw a punch? God, 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 God. So this man, Luffy, lifts up his hand and says, so you want to know if I can throw a punch, right? All right, then. Fuck around and fucking oh. Bro punched the dog water out of him. <laughs> Flattened his stupid ass for everybody to see. <laughs> that nigga was bouncing around. <laughs> It took one punch and was knocked the fuck out. That nigga trash. Nigga did all that work just to get one shot. Oh, ugly ass. Flattened his stupid ass for everybody to see. And just nonchalantly puts back his hat on. Oh, no, bro. Dog hit him with the nigga, you ain't shit. And look at his crew. They looking like, hey, bro, you, you good? The, <laughs> get up. Look right. Nigga, get your ass up. <laughs> bro, who was out Oh, he's missing and everything, but he better get ready for some dentures. Bro got knocked out so bad he ain't even wake up till we got to dress Rosa. Oh. <laughs>